Hi guys, welcome to the stream. <laughs> I'm live, obviously. <laughs> nice to see you guys here. I'm making my hair. <laughs> nice to see you all here. Good morning. It is morning, in my opinion, so welcome. <laughs> oh my god, am I muted? No, okay. <laughs> I have to just check every time I have this beer. Good morning, you guys. Welcome, chat. <laughs> Twisted says, writ time. I did my writ, but we are going to be playing Elder Scrolls and just kind of doing stuff that isn't really that exciting, but still could be fun just to hang out and do together. So we're going to scry and earn money and maybe do some questing and stuff, so we'll see. We'll just hang out and do whatever we want. How are you, Twisted? You just got home, didn't you? I hope you had a good day. I'm Kanye, how are you? <laughs> so my quote said, <laughs> I don't know if any of that is true, but it's not going to stop me from talking about it, which is my very first quote, actually. And then Kanye says that quote is a whole Stadia community when someone in EA sneezes. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Hi, Unitrix. How are you? Nice to see you. I'm too weak to take control. That's a that's a true quote. <laughs> I was. I was trying to break into someone's car and I was too weak to do it. <laughs> uh, Unitrix is in the UK, I think. Yeah. Kaka! Do you like that? <laughs> that is a specific quote for Link. You guys, whenever Link comes into chat, do quote 85 because he loves when I make that sound. You need to type hello there. I imagined Ewan McGregor. What? Is that a meme? Is that a meme? <laughs> Hi, Drennan. I also wish you were home. Because then we'll be playing together. Hi, Chris. Chris says, eh, meh. <laughs> Chris, are you not excited for the stream? <laughs> Good thanks, darling. Been a meh. Yeah, everybody's meh. Day so busy, but it is what it is. Almost Friday. We are almost at Friday, you guys. Actually, I need to go buy beer because Eddie said <laughs> I'm drinking Friday. <laughs> so, okay, that made it sound a little like he was demanding it, but he invited me <laughs> to have some drinks. So I'm gonna, so I gotta go buy some beer. But I don't feel like going anywhere because it's like minus 15. Okay, it's not that cold, but <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> you keep on using quote 85. I think your quote is 86 though. So is my ESO broker. No, Twisted, I checked this morning and no, I think you're going to end up paying about 120, but I'm going to keep checking. Like every time I go into the trader, I have the jewel crafting station there. So I just like check it again. So, but so far, no, the cheapest I saw this morning was 120. So I'm going to keep an eye out for, I'm shopping for Twisted, you guys. I don't believe that you're live. Raise your right hand. I swear I am live. Hi! What's cracking, Kai? <laughs> I like that. <laughs> I like your that's your name because it's easy to greet you in chat. How are you doing? Yeah, beer. Yeah. So I like to go um, to the store and then just pick some different cans of beer that are different fruit flavors and then drink them. So that's what I'm going to do. Because <laughs> I don't really love beer that much. I usually just get would drink like hard alcohol and mix it but these days it just if I'm just sitting on my computer chatting with you guys beer just feels right somehow Kai heard beer and was summered seriously I literally said that and then you appeared like what are the chances <laughs> Nate how are you hi Nate. good to see you yeah hi Nate <laughs> Nate I missed your all I saw was mommy and I don't know what the rest said you like going through the craft beer section? I guess that's what I do. I like going through the fruit beer section. My liquor store has a fruity beer section and that's where I go. I don't know. <laughs> you love it. <laughs> You're in the gray now, but I have my eye on you, Meg. Don't pull any pre-recorded stuff on us. Don't worry, guys. If I post a video, I might still do premieres. I like premieres. Premieres are fun. You're just working? Thanks for hanging out, Nate. I, I figured most people, or a lot of people, are working. But I know a lot of people... <laughs> there was a fruit fly. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> a lot of people will work and have it the stream on. So I thought, you know what, let's do it. I was going to go live at like 12.30. That was like an hour and a half ago. And then I was like, no. People literally complained when I went live at 9. So I don't want to go too early. So I figured like 1 o'clock. And it's like 1 o'clock now. Time is an elephant. 
<laughs> craft beers are a bit expensive. Yeah, they're like three or four dollars per can, but I don't, I, I drink like twice a month, once a month, less now. I meant to say, mmm. Oh, but you, you meant to say, mmm, but you said mommy. Wow, that could be awkward, Nate. You, ooh, that could be awkward in an intimate moment. <laughs> You need gold to buy furniture, or you need gold furniture? I need gold to buy furniture. I'll show you guys my house. Okay, let's- okay, let's get into it. Because gold- I do have a golden cow with wings mounted, um, in my dining room. But my furniture in general is not gold. So, I think that covers your question. Premieres suck ass, says Chris. I'm sorry that you guys didn't like my premieres, but it was the closest I could be to being live. Premieres are off-brand live streams, yeah. You could premiere Celeste. Don't you want to see Celeste live, Dave? I'm gonna do Celeste live. They can get expensive. Yeah, yeah, they can. Especially if you guys want fancy ones. Okay. You're level 5 on ESO? We all started at level 5. Well, we all started at level 1. There's my fade on my music. Oh, this screen isn't even right. I'm supposed to have like my Twitter and stuff on this screen. Guys. That could be awkward. Joke's on you. I'm into that. <laughs> the door now has my name on it. Kind of, that's cute. Oh, okay, guys. Let's play Elder Scrolls. Boom. I hope you guys have game sound. Ugh. I didn't check all that stuff. Bad at streaming. I think it's muted. It's muted right now. There. Time is an elephant. Okay, you guys should now have sound. Okay. If you are capable of doing live streams, why make us suffer with YouTube premieres? Well, because sometimes... Okay, so first looks... So are kind of maybe better as videos. Now, you guys as the viewers always say you want live, Chris. I know. But, like, I did Elijo first look. And, like, half of it was me talking to chat about unrelated things. So my first look is kind of, like... It's a first look, but, like, I'm half the time just ranting to chat about stuff. So, for for a first look video that's literally just like look at this let's discuss in this video i kind of want to record it offline and then post a video that's like first look like i was doing and then do my regular like streams like this live so that's kind of what i'm thinking but premieres are for when she's lazy no videos are a thousand times more work than live streams like so much more work i hate making videos and i respect the people who make videos all the time in this community yeah, Chris is like, premieres are more work. It's so much more work. You guys, if people make videos, go watch them and comment and like them. Because it literally, if the video is like 20 minutes long, it probably took them three hours to make. And like, if I put up an, and that's because they're experts. If I put up like an hour long video, it probably took me eight hours, like a full day to make it because I suck. So guys, where's my controller? Oh my God. It's on the floor. So, yeah, premieres, for me, are way more work. And I would much rather always just do live streams. Because <laughs> I'm lazy. Hi, Ruben. First looks are better suited for premieres. I think so, too. Yeah. Oh, my God, you guys. I'm playing in 4K. Oh, no, I don't use a controller for this game. I'm playing in 4K, and it looks amazing. So, you guys don't even know my Elder Scrolls. I haven't really streamed it that much. And when I have, it's been with other people, so I feel a lot of pressure to, like, do do stuff, you know? So this is kind of cool. We can just chill. Hi, Jay. How are you? <laughs> have a fun stream. Thank you, Ruben. <laughs> I, I expect I will. This is, like, this is the stuff that I do off stream, guys. And I decided to just stream it so we could do it together instead of me doing it by myself, so... Make sure you claw grip that controller. So yeah, so we discovered that Chris is like a claw grip controller person. And it was like, what? So this is my main character. Okay, so she's not, she doesn't have any clothes on right now. There was just a new life festival and you had to do like a polar bear plunge. 
that's what we call it. They call it something else in the game. But in Canada, we would call it a play. And they have to go swimming. And then after you get out, you warm up by the fire and you wear these rags. Anyway, so in celebration of it, I have her wearing it. And she's a healer. She doesn't need that much armor. You've been neglecting your baby. Aww. Um, but I have a bunch of characters. But this is the one we're going to use because she's my main. What's your class, Kai? Oh, it's saying my game may stop. So we're going to try this, guys. I am trying in 4K. Yesterday I played Crew 2 in 4K and my stream was fine. Except for the Crew 2 bug that made me have to turn off 4K. But I turned it back on for today. But I see little, like... Like, it's constantly, like, almost dropping down to 1080 a little bit and then back up. So I'll keep an eye on it. So I do usually play this on PC, but we're going to try it on Stadia. Oh, so, yeah, guys, let me show you my house. So this is my new house that I just bought. In my favorite town in the whole game. And Drennan has been helping... I mean, he's been doing it all, but he's been helping me furnish it. And um, <laughs> we're moving around a lot of stuff. So I did buy it with furniture, but I'm basically changing every room to be exactly the way I envisioned it. Uh, Kanye says, I never play ESL. My backlog is massive. I know. And this game is a lot of commitment. Like, <sighs> it, it, you can get sucked into it and it's really hard to leave. There's so much in this game that is awesome. So this is my house. So it's the Alenar townhouse in Somerset, which is the most beautiful city in the game. You guys will see once we get to my rooftop. So it's kind of half done, but I'll just kind of go through quickly, like, to just, oh, check my mail. Did you send me something? Is it in? I hope it's appropriate. Oh my god. Ah, steps. Thank you. Okay, good. Um. Ooh. Oh, and a tub. Thank you, Drennan. Like I said, Drennan's been doing everything. <laughs> oh, and a toilet. Well, it's a fountain, but we're going to use it as a toilet. Thank you, Drennan. Oh my god. I don't even know where we're going to put the bathroom, though. I don't know where to put this stuff. All right, let me take it. Oh, okay. So my guild is doing a giveaway for with raffle tickets. And if you win, you get an extra character slot. And right now I'm 9 out of 9. So I'm kind of excited about that. And I did buy one single ticket. So I don't know if I'll win, but... Thank you, Dren. Disclaimer, Meg's live streams for this week are test streams, and she may experience some issue. Yeah, that is true. That is true. Everything is a test now. Hey, Crazy, you know how you make your game stop lagging when you put it in your headset? That's a good question. I don't know. I haven't had that issue. Oh, look at all my mail. I'll do it later. I don't care. So this is my study. As you can see, like, the shelves are empty because I just moved in. This is Fedra. She, I hire her to do my research, um... She's like my historian. So I'm going to set her up in here. It's technically my office, but I just let her use it. Because I don't really have time to do that. I'm always out in the field. Oh, are you going backwards again, Unitrix? <laughs> it shouldn't... You've heard of that before, Chris? Okay. This is like a little kind of like bar lounge area. Um, that's... is John and put this together. It's really... It's nice. It's nice. I want some more seating, actually, now that I'm in here. This is the dining room. Oh, my God. I love the dining room. And there's my golden cow that I mentioned. He's the only golden furniture I have. <laughs> um, but this is the dining room. I love the dark wood in here. It's so nice. Oh, my God. Here's the kitchen. We're still working on the kitchen. As you can see, it's a work in progress. But we're going to have shelves over here and all types of fruit. I just wanted color, like color everywhere um, for the kitchen. So that's going to be the theme in here. And we've been working on getting um, lighting and everything set up. It crashed. Okay, good, Unitrix. This is where my banker and merchant are just temporarily. So we can talk to them and sell our stuff or like put our stuff in the bank or whatever. And then we go upstairs or have a little like throne area. I dug this up. Like, so part of the scrying that we're going to do in a minute, it's like archaeology and you can dig up cool stuff to put in your house. So I dug up the throne, the golden cow. I dug him up. 
And then this is like my private apartments in here. There's going to be um, a fire in that at some point. And I'm going to change this part all around to make it a little bit different. And then here's the bedroom up here, which is like a loft because you can like look down. <laughs> How cool is that? But somewhere we have to put a bathroom. I don't know where the bathroom's going to be. Like, I saw somebody, they had their bathroom, like, back here. But I don't really think I need the bathroom, like, right beside my bed. So, I don't know. We'll see about that. We'll see. We'll see. But this is the best part of the house outside. This is a guest room right now, but it will change. This is going to be, I think, a library. And then out here is the, oh, it's called the terrace. Yes. Hey, Twist is over. Hey, Twist. So this is my terrace. Also still, like, we're working on it. Um, but here I have all the crafting tables. So once we're done our dungeon runs, we can use the crafting tables here and do some cooking if we need to. Um, this is... I hear... Oh, I thought my alarm was going off. But it's not. Okay. This is going to be like a romantic like little getaway with like rom like plants and I want to put I don't know a waterfall or a fountain and I imagine like rose petals just like falling out of the sky um which Drent said is not possible but we'll work on it we're gonna we're gonna figure something out and then this used to be an open area but Drent built this cabin for me how cool is that out of marble so it cost me a fortune, <laughs> but it's totally worth it. And this is going to be the guest house instead of in the other room. I wanted the guests to have their own place, like not right in my room, in my house. So they could have their own little area. Thank you, Berserk. Yeah, I'm showing off my house. Hey, Chariot. How's it going? Chariot is in the house, guys. Glad your channel's back to normal. Me too. Right? It felt abnormal, didn't it? I'm glad that you said that. Yeah, we're back to normal here, which is awesome. Um, so yeah, so this is going to be... Now I'm still furnishing it. It's not... <gasps> Where's my rug? What? D G he Drennan? <sighs> the secret lover shack? No, it's for you guys. It's for my guests. <laughs> Did you move my rug, Twisted? What the hell? So guys, I bought this light with a bird on it, specifically. And I had a matching bird rug in here, but somebody moved it. I don't know why I give you guys permissions to move things around. Um, but yeah, so that's, so that's the house. And then, but I mean, check out the view of the city. So we have this little, we can go up here now, because we built this thing. Like, look at the view. Look at the city. This house was worth every penny. And this is my favorite, this is my favorite, um, um, city in the whole game. On my favorite island in the game. So, I had to buy this house. I had to. So I did. <laughs> oh, and here's a little seating area for the guests. So, yeah. So there we go. So, Dren, why did you move my bird thing? I saw it downstairs. And I was like, I already owned one of these? But you, well, like, I told you specific- What?! How many birds are there? It's a bird theme. Okay, I don't know what's happening. <laughs> I don't know what's happening with the bird rugs, guys. But see how this bird matches the, the light? That's what I was going for. I won't when Dren is working hard on it. Okay, so Twisted said he's not in it. <laughs> Getaway spot for River. No, guys. River and I are done. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> I'm done with River. Only house I've ever messed was Matt's, and that's when me and Dren turned everything upside down. Oh my god. I didn't do shit. I didn't do shit, he says. <laughs> I don't understand. When I left, this bird mat was upstairs. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> so there's my house, guys. So, however... I'm, like, out of money now. <laughs> All right, let's put this... Okay, wait, let's put the tub... Oh, guys, where's the bathroom gonna go? Uh, I think somewhere in the private... I imagined it kind of, like, here. Like, let me show you guys what I'm thinking. I'm gonna put the tub. Is it called a tub or a bath? A bath? Halalu tub. Okay. All right, so we could put the tub like here. 
and then put a little wall. Is there a ceiling? Oh, God. That's what I'm thinking. And then there's like a fountain. Which will be the toilet. Guys, look at this. going to be the toilet. So the game doesn't have like things. So you have to just like make things work. So I don't know. Maybe here. I don't know, Dren. We got to figure this out. <laughs> oh, yeah. I think that's perfect. I think I nailed it. <laughs> I think that's great. Yeah, we'll just leave it like that. That's perfect. <laughs> Go check out my turlet. What, did you make, did you get one too, Dren? At Hundings? You're going to decorate my own house and leave, <laughs> let alone yours. Yeah, okay, Twisted. Yeah, your house is so cool though, Twist. You're going to play super hot? Okay, Unitrix. Dren, don't watch this. It's going to give you pain. It's not straight. I think, I actually think that looks amazing. Okay, guys, let's go check out Dren's house, and then we'll go do some scrying. He's saying that he had made some upgrades to his toilet. Yeah? Okay, let's go see. So, but that's my house, guys. Um, okay. Dren -n 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 -n. So I think what he's saying is he put one of these things in his house. Just a sec, guys. I'm so cold. I have to close the door. One sec. So this is Drenning's house called Hundings. We checked this out on my last stream. We will do tours occasionally because I do love showing off our houses. <laughs> and by our houses, I mean like Dren's house. <laughs> but um, one second, guys. I just have to start my music. Now that the stream is underway. Now that I have enough internet to do more than one thing. <laughs> I can listen to music, <laughs> which I like forgot how to do last night and started playing that Witcher song to the whole stream. Thank God Drennan like recognized it and was like the Witcher or I would have listened to my whole playlist and had to copyright my whole stream. Solar Conch, how are you? Am I your number one? Thank you. That's so nice of you. Sammy, how are you, Sammy? Nice to see you. Well, this is a UK friendly stream. I mean, I mean, we're all friendly, but <laughs> I'm doing great. <laughs> I got fast internet, and now I can do whatever I want, and I'm really happy about it. Okay. I assume it's the best, like, your main bathroom. Do, 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 do. Wow. That looks great. I can't believe you didn't do this before. Wow. So, I mean, okay, I would like Drennan to make me one of these. One of these bathrooms. Bathrooms are his specialty. Sounds weird to say that, but it's true. Doing well, yes, UK friendly tree time. Yeah. How much did I pay for it? For for my house? That's a good question. Seventy five hundred crowns. I did have to buy a few number of crowns. I could have bought it for a million gold, which was all the gold I had. And it would have been empty. And then I would have had to pay for everything. So I caved and I spent a little bit of money on crowns for the house. I think it was worth it. <laughs> Internet. Internet is cheaper. Or the same. What did mom say? It's $10 more. I don't know. It's like $100. I think it's the same in the end. So, but it's way faster. So before we had 10 megabytes down and one megabyte up, and now we have 50, five zero megabytes down and 10 up. So five times as fast downloads and 10 times as fast uploads. So I couldn't be happier. I honestly couldn't be happier. Even if we had a gig down and a gig up, I wouldn't even care because all I need is what I have. So I'm, it's perfect. Valley of Plenty. Okay, where's my stuff? All right, let's do this. Hey, thank you. Ah! Oh my God, I even knew it was coming and it 
scared me. Thank you, Ruben, for the donation. He's donating two euros to Meg's new house fund. Thank you so much. <laughs> I will put that to good use. <laughs> Kitchens. Jen says kitchens. Okay, guys. So let's look. So here's his bathroom. Okay. So, but he says his kitchen is better. So let's go see. If anyone here does play super hot, go to super hot menu, find videos button and click on ransom.avi. There you go, guys. Hackers and super hot. Here's the kitchen. I always hate twist. I don't know. This kitchen is nice. What do you guys think? Is the bathroom nicer or the kitchen nicer? I think the bathroom is nicer. I like the plant action in the bathroom. This is very nice, but I think the bathroom is better. Your tables need some animals. <laughs> some of them, you're such a weirdo, Chris. Oh, Chris, I missed your message about the pets in my house, and you're right, and I will, because you're right. Game suggestion. Houses are your specialty, Seastren. You did a bang up job on all of them so far. I agree. Your house is next listed. If you have it on Stadia. What game? AC Odyssey. I do. I have. Check out my playlist. In fact, I will get it for you. Because I think my mods are all working. So I feel bad to make them work. <laughs> hey, Dubsta. How are you? Here I am. I'm back. I got that thick internet. So now I can do whatever I want. And this is what I'm doing. I played a lot of AC Odyssey. Um, I think, well, I say a lot. I mean, I played a long time playing it, but I think I'm only like level like 25. Um, how do I see all playlists? But let me see if I have a playlist of um, Assassin's Creed for you. Yeah, I do. So I streamed it four times, it looks like. Possibly more. But yeah, check it out, Solar Conch. Oh, no, I did it wrong. Okay, there. I have to use my laptop for everything or I'm going to F up my controls on this game. <laughs> Bye, and Kanye. Good student. Good for you. Don't skip school. Go to class. You're a good student. Hey, Luke, how are you? Nice to see you. Awesome. I just need some crowns. I want a flame mount. <laughs> All right, guys, let's go to Twisted's house. And we'll check his house really quick. What did Dren say? You scouted it? Last night with Matt, you have options. Are you guys... So, I think Twist is looking at making... A cabin as well. I think Dren wants to make a cabin. Um, up at Twisted's. <laughs> I'm looking at your channel. I just started playing Shadow of the Tomb Raider. I'm so happy. It's so fun. Yeah! Seriously, check out my playlist section. I have so many games that I streamed. Um, and I try to keep, like, I try to keep them all in their playlist. I do miss some videos now and then, though. But yeah, Solar Crimes, check it out. I love Tomb Raider. I think Rise of the Tomb Raider was my favorite, actually. And then Shadow, and then the first one, whatever that was called. <laughs> Smack in my head, why? You're on lunch break? Oh, yeah. Well, thanks for hanging out. This is working out for your lunch breaks. My, These are kind of my new streaming times. So, Twisted's house is like war effort. That's what he always says. <laughs> so, it's like a little war camp. This was all just empty space when he first got it, though. How cool is that? And now he has, like, all of this stuff. We, we looked at it a little bit more in detail last stream. This is a nice little kitchen hut area, actually. Twist did a great job on this. Where's the thrones? That looks like it needs a throne. I think he's still... Wait, this is... He's just doing something. He, this is just his furniture area. Okay, I take it back. I'm gonna build a two-story house here. And Twisted's place? I understood you, Dren. 
Rise of the Tomb Raider is my favorite Stadia game. Wow. Finishing it. Nice. Not used to hearing your accent. Where are you from, Luke? Do, 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 do. This is the throne area, right? And I want this table. So yeah, we gotta go scry, guys. I want stuff. So I said that they should build the cabin out there. So you can walk. Like you he put those he put those braziers out there. So I know that he can like you can go out there. So I said go build it out there. How cool is that? You're from North Texas. Cool. Okay. Yeah, nice. So I uh, that's but I don't think I don't nobody nobody else liked that idea except me. <laughs> so I don't think they're gonna do it. <laughs> what well, accent does make have Canadian <laughs> To an American, I would say I have a Canadian accent. To a Canadian, I probably have an East Coast accent. <laughs> to a Nova Scotian, I have a Valley accent. To the Valley, I have no accent. <laughs> that's how. That's what it is. I literally just nailed it. <laughs> nailed it! <laughs> this is so cool. Build it by the water. I take it back. Build it down here. This is the perfect spot for a cabin. And Okay, get rid of the cage. Put the cabin here. False wall here, hidden by library books. Like a library door shelf. And then you come in down here. And it's a secret tunnel into the rest of the place. We don't even need to talk about it anymore. Because that's the perfect idea. What's down here? Oh, you got one of these fountains. Nice. This is the same one that Dren has in, in Hundings. Or here, actually. So if you don't like the secret place idea, then this would also be a great space for a cabin. A two-story. That's what I say. You're dealing with something. No worries, Twist. I'm just going to look at your house <laughs> and then go scry. <laughs> And then this has a whole, like, complex inside. I don't know if Twisted... I don't know if he's done anything with it yet. Last time I was here, he hadn't done much. But it did come with stuff. You're from Little Elm, Texas? <laughs> it sounds little. <laughs> you have the same... You sound the same as people over here, except for the use of supper. <laughs> I can't believe that you guys all latch onto that. Because <laughs> it's funny because I've traveled a lot, a lot, a lot of my life. And no one has ever given me a hard time about saying supper. I didn't know. Yeah, okay, so this is the same. But this is nice. Isn't this cozy? You're from the south. People say you have an accent. Or the south. Yes, so, Luke, so about the South. So I used to always say Southern until Americans taught me that you're supposed to say Southern. When you're talking about the States, you have to say Southern. People get touchy. <laughs> so yeah, guys, so there, there you go. So we're all working on our... Oh, this is a great view. Oh, wow, look at that. Oh, yeah, that's really cool. Take a screenshot. Oh, I'm on Stadia. Can I use my controller? I need to figure out how to take screenshots. I want to, like, um, take screenshots uses my thumbnails. I made a thumbnail of my unicorn for Phoenix Rising, and I loved it so much that I made a thumbnail for of my little baby Indrik <laughs> for this. I don't know if you guys noticed I changed his thumbnail, but anyways, I did it. <laughs> Food is food. Let's go. What are you talking about, Ruben? Food, food? Making me hungry. Referring to Meg accent compared to people in Toronto. Right. Yeah. I knew. I, I got you, Chris. Anyone else here from Texas? Or USA? Yeah. A lot of people are from America. Drennan. Drennan is from Texas. I was like, I was like, wait. Twisted is UK. Chris is Canadian. Ruben is European. Germany or Belgium? I can't remember, Ruben. 
Please play it again and restart, because you probably don't remember half of it. I won't restart, but I probably will play it again. Killa, what's good, Killa Platypus? How you doing? Egg your idea. F your idea. Oh, I'm going to build it where the fountain is by the waterfall. Yeah, Drennan. Yeah, that was my number two. My idea was great and the best, but the second best idea was the, my second idea, which was your first idea. So pretty close. I forgive you. <laughs> Belgian. Yeah, yeah, Belgium. Ruben is German. Well, he's Belgian. And I know they speak, um, they speak German and Dutch there. I was in Belgium once for like a day. Like I, I can't even say I've even really been there. We like went there to a school to hear a lecture and then we ate and then drove back. to the Netherlands. So it was like one day. I didn't even spend the night. All right, guys, let's scry. So we're going to shift from housing a little bit to scrying, which is how I'm going to earn some money. <laughs> what scrying means basically it's archaeology and we're going to do it together. And I'm not going to go into great detail of everything I'm doing unless you guys have specific questions. But I just naturally narrate, so you guys will probably learn something just by accident. Oh, that's a good screenshot. Oh. Um. There we go. There, screenshot saved. I There's no, like, keyboard hotkey for that. Elm is country AF. So you're rural, Luke? America number one. Joking, I'm into a lot of countries. That's okay, Luke. I'm used to that attitude from Americans. <laughs> Little Elm. So it's rural. I'm from a rural area too, Luke. I always say I live in a field. Blake, how's it doing? How's it doing? How's it doing, Blake? That's how I say things now. Favorite milkshake, Little Misses. From milkshake and some food. That's nice, Twisted. And she did she get it delivered right to you? That's so sweet. I feel like it's been forever since I've been on your stream. Yeah, a little bit, Blake. I met a Blake, I think, in Cyberpunk. And I was like, shout out to Blake Stadia. <laughs> but that was like a week ago. <laughs> F12, Killa? What do you mean? Is that that game? Dutch, French, German, English were like the Switzerland of the European Union. Lots of languages in a small country. Yeah. F12. Why are you guys saying F12? Oh, well, that's. Oh, yeah? Hey, thanks, guys. Awesome. Okay. See you later, Luke. Thanks for thanks for coming out. We'll see you later. Native American, German, Irish, Scottish. Yeah. You're also learning Italian. Wow, that's crazy. Do you speak all those languages, Solar Do you speak German and or well, okay, wait, Gaelic? Uh <laughs> Alright guys. So scrying. So you have to like Search for my old internet just went down. So we have two lines. I have the fast line and the old line. My old internet just went down and the fast one stayed on. I'm amazed right now. Oh my god. No, you don't. Okay, that's okay. I can't believe that that happened. <laughs> I'm definitely gonna cancel that line after my testing today. So guys, I have to do, so I'm basically filling in like my codex, which is a list of everything that you can dig up, um, to get the purple ones with their worth, they're worth 5,000, which is quite a lot. And so I need a bunch of these so that I could buy stuff for my house. <laughs> Anyone speak a bit Chinese, like Mandarin? No. Italian is better than German. How can you say that? What does it even mean? How can you even say how who do who knows? How what does better even mean? <laughs> so I've done the Alder Mary Dominion. I've done Daggerfall Covenant. And now I'm going on to Ebonheart Pact. So this is there isn't like an infinite 
amount of money I can earn from this, but I am going to earn what I can. So we have to go to Balfoyen to scry it. So let's do it. So I'm hoping someone is there so I don't have to pay to travel. Um, there is somebody there. Yes. So I can travel to him for free. <laughs> Sucka! Dude, I can't believe my old internet went down. So if I had been streaming, like, if I didn't have this new internet, our stream would have just died and we all would have just dispersed into the YouTube net, like, never, never land. <laughs> you know, sign language? I think you only know one thing in sign language, Dren, and it's the, your favorite emote that you send me all the time. <laughs> German is hard to master. So it probably is Italian. I just about managed to speak English. You're good. You're good. <laughs> So let's scry now that we're here. Oh. And with this green one, we'll find a blue one and then a purple, and then we get what we're actually looking for. I still need to go to the public library, get some books for the Italian language. Oh, that's a good idea. Can't you do all that stuff online though these days? Do you, are you actually gonna travel somewhere? <laughs> Dren, okay, I guess you do know more than one emote. <laughs> Uh, all right, guys, let's scry, scry, scry. Do, 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 do. I want my internet to come back so I can um, keep listening to my music, which I have stuck in my head. Wow, Balfoyen is tiny. This is a great place to scry. All right, let's head up there. Do, 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 do. Library. <laughs> What the f W? What the what the what this, what year is it? That's what I mean. I was like, are you gonna physically travel to the library? Like, oh, how do I get out of this place? Okay, yeah, this is the way. Can be both British and European. I am dual citizen. I am both a citizen of well, the UK and of Canada. I have two passports, and I have used them both. No, make no blinding lights. The song was already stuck in my head for a year. How do you know I'm listening to blinding lights? How do you know I'm listening to blinding lights? <laughs> That's on my playlist. I was literally listening to that a second ago. Can you guys hear it? Can you, can you guys, he can you guys hear my music? No, you can't. I'm gonna get copyright striked. <laughs> Flake State, if you have a PlayStation 4, add me. Yeah, guys, I'll add each other on all of your things. And I'll hang out. And game together. I just learned the swear words in other languages, Killa. That's good. Uh, my wife still chooses to use a library. Oh my god, Blake. I can't believe you live in like 20 and 25 years ago. I haven't been to the library since I was a baby. Hey, Jam, good afternoon. Almost evening. <laughs> That's just weird. It's not weird. I mean, I wouldn't go to the library nowadays, guys, given the state of the world. I was singing along to... Oh, my God. Guys, I sing along to things and I don't realize like an idiot. I can't. The internet is dead. Did they, did they disconnect our second line? <sighs> Damn it. <laughs> You're British? I am. My dad is British, guys. So, because he was British, tell us the story. That's the story. My dad's British, and so I never lived there, but because he's British, I just had to fill out some forms and um, send in a bunch of stuff, and then they accepted me, so because I was by blood, basically. So I had my British citizenship. So I was able to travel over there really easily. And I went to school in Holland for a year and I paid local rates. All my, all my friends who, well, all the friends I made there who went from the United States and Canada, they were paid like 25,000 euros in tuition. And I was taking the exact same program. And I only had to pay like 2,500 because, um, because I had my citizenship, so it was amazing. Um, and it was really easy to travel around while I was over there because I was a citizen. I wasn't, I wasn't like a foreigner. So that was pretty cool. <laughs> Babies go to the library? I was a little kid at school when I went to the library. <laughs> 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 
Your phone is killing you. Holland has Wii vending machines? I didn't see any when I was there. <laughs> Not that I noticed. I probably would have used one if I had seen it, but I did not. <laughs> I can't believe I was um, <laughs> humming songs. I didn't even realize it. That's kind of embarrassing, but I hope you guys don't mind. You feel like we're family? <laughs> yeah, it's kind of cool. My dad, like, he doesn't have an accent or anything anymore. Because he actually moved to Canada with his family when he was, like, six. Um, <laughs> so he hardly even, like, really counts as, like, British. Because he doesn't have his accent or anything. <clears throat> That's crazy, guys. My other, my secondary internet is down, and that's how I was kind of controlling the stream. So that's kind of too bad, but oh well. Killa Platypus says, I've never been to a library. <laughs> how does Jim know that? Yeah, let's, let's ask the real hard questions. <laughs> Give me one sec, guys. Yeah, so my internet is not down, but my second internet line is down. It's okay, guys. <laughs> I've dealt with worse, and I'll deal with worse again. <laughs> You mind because it's stuck in your head and again so sorry Ruben so guys so I have the fast internet which is 50 and the old internet which is 10 um, and the old one is the one that just went down so and it's down down like I don't even think it came back yet oh yes it did okay it came back all right let me get my music <laughs> Hi, Johnny. He says, make your machine out here on the left coast. Left coast? That's funny. You streamed till I went to bed, and now you're going again before I go to work. <laughs> yeah, well, yesterday was not my usual stream times. Um, this will be more, like, going forward will be more my usual times. But yeah, now that I have the internet, guys, I don't have so many restrictions on, like, when and how I can stream. I can kind of do what I want, so that's nice. All right, guys, we're going to get to scrying in a second here. You lived in Rotterdam for a year. Didn't see any weed vending machines. I didn't see any either. I feel like maybe there's like one or two in Amsterdam. But I don't think they're like on every corner. At least not when I was there. Did you really beat Superhot with your bare hands, Unitrix? They're newer. Oh, okay, maybe that's why. Johnny, we just discovered she's Canadian British, so she lives in two different time zones. Yeah, I travel back and forth and I stream in each time zone. No, Goblin, not Ritz. Scrying. Yeah, we're going to scry in a second here. I'm like 35 in AC Odyssey. I'm like something. I'm like 25 or something, Solar Conch. 
<laughs> yeah, we're going to scry. I know it's not exciting. This is a hangout stream more so than anything. Are you going to teach us how to do the Ritz? <laughs> um, I can if you want. Not right now because I already did my Ritz. But um, I can in the future. I'm going to take a quick break, guys, and just refresh my coffee. Um, I want it to be an iced coffee, so I'm going to go make it icy. Um, and uh, I'll be right back.
Okay, I got my iced coffee. It is in an open top lid, <laughs> which I know I'm not allowed to have according to my own rules. But, you know, sometimes you don't have a sippy cup and you just have to use a mug. But I do have a straw. <laughs> so I can drink it <laughs> like a baby. <laughs> <laughs> okay guys I missed a whole bunch of chat I have to check it <laughs> I hope I don't break my <laughs> oh but if I break my game I can just restart so it's not a big deal so that's awesome does Hitman out yeah Hitman went out yesterday and I streamed it that's correct oh my god you guys are talking how much did you talk <laughs> you use the katana London is still so empty Blake, you and Jem are both heading home from work in empty London. I streamed it. Can my, can one of you guys... Uh, you guys are all busy, but if someone could put my Hitman stream in there, that would be awesome. I live streamed it, Luke. It was awesome. Link! Hi, Link! Link, you came during my Be Right Back screen, but now I am Be Right back you might have to get it when you can. <laughs> no worries, Luke. Yeah, it's fun. If you like the first one or the second one, you'll like the third. It's the same. Move closer to work. <laughs> More time for gaming. Twisted knows. Twisted lives close and he walks in the rain <laughs> and watches my streams <laughs> and then games. <laughs> Still trying to catch up on backlog from Christmas sale. Yeah, no kidding. Twisted Stadia baby gaming all the time. Yeah, oh yeah. Do you game on the... um? underground so is, is that right i called it the metro and everybody was like no meg <laughs> hey guys just notice there's not more people watching than there are likes this stream can we fix that yeah thank you everybody for your likes i really appreciate it more than you know guys it isn't like <sighs> all the easiest but it is so nice to be back here with you guys so thank you for the likes breaking all the times today I'm just doing whatever I want. <laughs> Gaming on the move is golden. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Empty London where I'm in traffic. <laughs> Guys, I'm still not caught up on chat. Oh my god. I've been here just not chatty. Awesome, Link. Thank you for your lurky support. Thank you guys. Check out my latest Hitman video. There it goes. Make streams Hitman in the chat. Check out the link. Boom! My mods are on the ball today. Super hot is now challenging me by giving you hard mode. Good, Unitrix. You play so much, you need a challenge now. You win, says Chris. Mods are trying hard. Thank you, mods. <laughs> the tube? Is it called the tube? The metro? Is it underground? We call it the subway. What? What is it called? Link not trying. It's okay. <laughs> it's the underground because it's under the ground. <laughs> you don't need to try. You're already fabulous, Linky. Yeah, yeah, he is. You don't have to try. One sec, guys. Moby wants to leave the room. <laughs> okay. I'm back. Let's do this. A what? Wolfi, welcome. How are you? Thank you for stopping by. Am I watching the Resident Evil things later? No, I don't know about that. Tell me about it. Maybe I will watch it. Mom, hi, Mom. I'm scrying. Well, supposedly. I haven't done anything yet. Mom, the old internet is down. Like, down, down. <laughs> so, I think we're probably just going to cancel it. But I'm going to do testing after this stream. <laughs> uh, Mama Tron in the house. Alright, guys, let's scry. So, I think... We found it. Now we just have to go to it? Oh, yeah. 
Okay, it's over here. Oh my god, is it seriously up there? What? Okay. I think it's actually really easy to get to. <laughs> I'm freaking out over nothing. <laughs> okay. Oh my god, it's right here. That was the easiest. So, it's funny that I'm scrying this because remember Link, I rate like... The first time I did this, I missed a key, like, part, so I could never find these dig sites, and I literally did it for two hours, couldn't find the site. Rage quit. Like, rage quit the session. I was playing with Link, and, like, Chris and Fluffy, maybe, Link? I can't remember. Like, we were playing as a group, and I literally... No, Mom, don't call them. I'm gonna- don't call yet. I'm gonna do troubleshooting. Don't worry. I'll call and be you if we need anything. Don't worry about it. Don't worry. No, don't call! Don't call! Because what if they shut off this internet and ruin the stream? No, don't do anything. Don't do anything. <laughs> I'll, uh, I'll look into it after. <laughs> um, oh yeah, and I couldn't find the mound for like two hours, and I rage quit- the session, I abandoned Link and my team, and I rage quit the game. Like, I didn't play Elder Scrolls, like, for months. Like, I stopped. I was done. That was it. I didn't play anymore. Um, and then I literally learned there's, like, a secret button you, like, you press that will, like, tell you where to go. Okay, guys, I'm not doing a very good job at this. Okay, whew, we found it. I haven't failed one of these in a long time, but it is possible I could fail. And if I were to fail, it would be on stream because one, everyone's watching and they could laugh at me. And two, because I'm distracted by chat and that's what I would say happened. <laughs> secret button. So by secret button goblin, so for those of you who play this game, I never knew you could equip the antiquarian eye in your hotbar and press it to have it literally just show you where the mound is. So I was running around for hours just like in these areas just hoping I would see a mound so it would take me like 45 minutes to do one and I was like how do people waste their time on this profession a wild distraction in chat appeared <laughs> I watch your Celeste stream you repeat oh my god you guys Celeste how do you like playing with your add-ons? It's fine, Chris. The add-on... Oh, sorry. The add-ons are only beneficial for, like, certain things that you're doing in the game. So, um, so I don't mind it. So, like, I probably won't stream my Ritz because I have an add-on that basically does my Ritz for me. And I don't want to do it the old way the old way being the way everyone else has to do it so i probably will always do my ritz off stream i was gonna do them manually but when i get up i can't talk i'm so tired i can't function i can't stream that you guys would be like who the hell is this person like who is this like just person so i i i will do my ritz off stream but then i'll do other stuff with you guys okay oh, hey, i didn't know that it shows where it is yes it points to you in the- Oh my god, Goblin. I will show you one second. Oh my god. I will show you. It like point- Ugh. Goblin, you are going to be so happy that you tuned in. All right. Hours. It saves me hours. All right. We'll do this blue one. So guys, I have developed a scrying technique. Where I like to start off really strong. Like that. Boom! And then just fill in all the little ones at the end. That's my technique and I love it. <laughs> it shows the area, but then it, well, you'll see. The pointy thing. Yeah, Chris, it's the pointy thing. So here's the area. So this is normal. So here I can see like, okay, it's in this area. So once I get up there, I'll use the antiquarian eye, which you can see goblin I have equipped here in my hotkey. So I have it selected. So once we get up there, once you press the antiquarian eye, a small little arrow will appear over your head <laughs> that will literally take you to it. <laughs> it's so... And the, the tutorial, like, don't feel, goblin, like you missed something. The tutorial does not tell you. 
this game is so dumb. I wish I wasn't addicted to it so I could do other things with my life. Ugh! Hard mode isn't that hard, it's just like normal mode. Yeah, but Unitrix, you're like a master at that game. So I come, so what I do is I go into the middle of the search area, press your hotkey, see, look, so it's telling me, boom, it's that way. So I just have to go around the corner and there it is, boom, done. So imagine how long it would have taken me to cordon off that whole area of the map and go up and down and look behind every building and under every shrub and behind every tree. Like, oh my God, it tells you, but people don't read the instructions. I challenge you to a duel, Link. How droll. How can we have a proper contest? <laughs> you don't even know the Altmer code of dueling. <laughs> Does anybody get my joke, please? <laughs> oh, okay. Wow, I found it second click. Oh my god, I am the scrying master. Okay, guys, let's get our sh let's get our goods. Let's get the goods, and then like you can use the trowel to like make your searching for the. Oh well, that actually worked out in my favor. To make it like go a bit longer, but I don't really care. I don't really care. Why would anyone read something like it? Thank you, Goblin. Why would anyone read words in a game, Link? Ugh. Different strokes for different folks. Link listen like Link reads the words in games and he listens to the things people say in games. Like what kind of behavior is that? What kind of game is he playing? <laughs> oh, Resdani Signet. So this is what we're after, purples. There's only one in each zone and you only well there's only one worth 5,000 in each zone. Non-gamers, oh, Link, get out. I, how do, You are not the gatekeeper to decide who is a gamer and who isn't. Anybody who plays a game and enjoys it and wants to identify as a gamer can. Full stop. You are not the gatekeeper for that. <laughs> Listen to me. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm ranting today. I'm fired up. <laughs> All right, so this one... I may not come on as strong as I did the beginning of the other one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dren got me. Dren got it. <laughs> I read words, I make sentence good. Reiterating what Goblin said, not my word. Instructions are for non gamers <laughs> and old people. <laughs> you need to read root instructions. Why wouldn't you if it tells you how to play Unitrix? I like to discover the hard way, and that makes me rage quit games. So clearly my way is better. So I think I'm going to start... See, this one is kind of hard to start with the snowflake um, option. But I do kind of want to spread in that direction early on. I want to spread in a direction early on. Actually, this would be a great option like this. I think I'm going to do that. And then this one, I'm going to connect with my Farsight. Boom, like that. And then this one, I'm going to connect like this. And then I'll do my Farsight up to here. And then one more. Boom. Done. Hey, gang. I've got... What, Moby? I've got a bounce. Home now, dinner ready. Chow, chow. Bye, Blake. Thank you for hanging out. Nice. You made it home. Your food is ready. Enjoy. Sekiro makes me rage quit. Celeste makes me rage quit. Oh, my God. Celeste is the most ragey game. I keep telling people I'm going to do it, and then I don't do it, because I don't want to. Okay. Let me see if that guy is still in Balfoy Inn. No. It's just me. Okay. I'll fast travel. This, you know what? This island is so small. Let's just ride. I'm not doing anything anyways. So Goblin, do you think, do you like that thing? Do you feel like that's helpful? Uh, are you like amazed and happy right now at your new archaeology career? 
Thanks again, Meg. You're awesome. <laughs> My fellow Brit. I am. God save the queen. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, we totally, we have the queen. Like, Canada is like half British anyways. We, have, we still have the queen on our money, and we're still part of the Commonwealth, and... Like, it's the Queen's Governor General who opens our government, so, like... But, I mean, it's all just a formality at this point. Like, it, it's just... It's not real. It doesn't mean anything. You're out. But with that... Oh. Okay. Bye, Link. The Guardian Ape on Sekiro. See? Yes! Okay, glad. I'm glad, Goblin. Um, I never played Sekiro because isn't that a really hard game? I still don't like scrying. I just want the Ring of Pale Order, then I'm done. So you are trying to get... Eventually, I will try to work on getting that higher level stuff. I think it's right here. Yeah. <laughs> um... And I, like, once I have done all the money, once I've got all the gold out of it I can, then I'll start working on specific leads. Okay, I have to be careful here because... I think it goes this way. Um. Okay. So you basically, I'm not going to go into detail about this stuff, but you basically use your tools to carefully excavate the item without breaking it. Because you can break it. Back to killing stuff? Yeah. Yeah. I, I'm doing a mix. Honestly, I haven't run dungeons in like a week. It's just crazy. Oh. Alright. Let's lower an area that looks safe. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. I also don't want to blow it up. I've never destroyed an artifact. And I don't want to start now. I usually don't find bonus loot loot on purples. Although once I found like two, I was amazed. All right, that's it. <laughs> so bad. You just gotta learn the way the game sort of works with the blocking and attacking mechanics. Mm. I'm not good at that stuff, though, Luke. I don't think that's my thing. I don't. I really don't. Hey, Spiffy Mark looks chill. It is chill. Yeah, this is a chill stream. We're just chilling and chatting and doing stuff in this game. Doing, like, non-combat things in this game. Just, like... Because there's a lot of... there's You can spend a lot of time in Elder Scrolls not fighting. Just doing random stuff. Like gathering or crafting. Scrying. There's all kinds of stuff to do. Stuff with your house. So that's it. So we find it and then we just scry another one. And that's it. So this is chill. So I would do this... Like, I would spend time chatting or just on like um on twitter or watching youtube and just doing this and i was like why don't i just stream it and we can just hang out while, like while people are working and just chat because i would have just been watching and then no one was live that was the other thing so i was getting ready for the for like whatever i was going to do today my writs and stuff and i wanted to watch youtube while i was doing my writs and no one was live and i was like Ugh. I was like, man, I just want to do my writs and watch YouTube. And I like live content. You guys, I like live better. I don't watch a whole lot of videos. Um, I try to watch stuff that, you know, content, my, my friends and my content creator buddies and Stadia put out. But if I, sometimes I just want to chill with a live stream and I don't really have to pay attention. And no one was live, so I was like, I'll do it. I was like, I have the internet now. It can be me. I was like, oh yeah, I can do it. <laughs> so I went live. <laughs> I'm not sure why killing red glass people entertain me. <laughs> when you say red coats, <laughs> what did you mean by that, Dren? <laughs> I've been playing World War. Wait, what? Wrestling, WWE, whatever the wrestling thing. Battleground on Stadia Day. It's really cool. Every night I play Destiny too. I play a lot of Destiny Rodney with Link actually, who was just here. Um, 
and uh, and we stream it. So stay tuned because um, yeah, we do Destiny. And at the end of my Destiny streams, we do Crucible and we pick up people from chat. So if you like Crucible at all, Rodney, then you should come and play with us because we pick up everybody who wants to play. We try to get them in. Can't remember the last time I watched TV. Oh, me neither. No, no, no. Yeah, me neither. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I think I ran Link off. Ugh. Dumb. There we go, guys. That's easy. So the, so they go in level of difficulty. I don't know if you guys saw that, but green is easy. Blue is medium. Purple is hard. Gold is harder. Orange slash red is like impossible. It takes like, but those ones you have to get a bunch of pieces to get them. Hey, Kid Bangerang says, how would you feel if they added DC Universe Online to Stadia? I would feel great. You could say, how would you feel if they added any game to Stadia? And I would say, I feel great about that. Wait, okay. <laughs> Pretty much any game. <laughs> there, I have discovered some weird games in my life that I don't want to play. And I don't particularly want on my platform. <laughs> but overall, I would say, yeah, sure. <laughs> I don't, I don't love the DC universe, like, I, I don't not love it. I'm not a huge superhero person is what I'm trying to say. And if I had to pick, I would pick Marvel universe. So if DC stuff never came to Stadia, I wouldn't be sad. But also I wouldn't, ah, what? <laughs> I was not expecting that. Okay, well, that's one way to get to a way shrine. Uh, <laughs> it actually put me... Oh, no. I thought it put me closer. It didn't. Damn. I can't believe I just died there, you guys. I totally thought I could take that fall. I don't have a food buff on. I think that's why, because that was dumb. Oh, my God. <sighs> Can we get a name of these games? <laughs> of the DC games? DC Universe Online. That's the game, isn't it? I think that's what he's saying, Unitrix. I thought that's what the game was. I don't know what that game is. I would probably play it. If Marvel Avengers was an MMO like this, I would have gotten it. But I don't want to play... I don't want to... I didn't... I'm glad I didn't get that game in the end. I was like... I, I was like pressured to and I wanted to. But I decided to let the hype... I was like, let me wait a week or two and see how people feel of it about it. Because when it first came out, everyone was playing Avengers. But then after a little bit, it didn't seem like people were playing it as much. And I was like, if it was an MMO, I would get into it. But it's like a little bit different style of game. So I don't think I could get into it. No, the games that you call disturbing. No, I'm not going to promote them. But they're just games that deal with like things that I don't find that I want to be involved in. So... I mean, basically, you have a bunch of people <laughs> that make Marvel characters. <laughs> oh, in the DC Universe game? That's hilarious. Oh my god, that's hilarious. <laughs> I think that'd be fun. I would play a superhero MMO. I don't mind. I, I can't guarantee I'm going to get into every MMO as much as I got into this one. There we go. Been playing Destiny 2 for some time. Yeah, guys. Destiny 2 is a great game. And I have a long history with Destiny 2. Um, and I'm really happy that Link and I got back into streaming it together. And it's been super fun. So make sure you guys check that out. Um, I don't know when we're going to be streaming it next. Uh, today's Thursday? Um, Link has kind of more of a streaming like schedule than I do. So we'll see when he has um, a chance and we'll play it again because I've been having a really good time with it. I'm glad I bought the expansion too. Okay. Basalt table game set. I wish these were real th I wish all of these things were real things I could put in my house. I wouldn't sell any of it. My house would just be filled with trash. <laughs> Oh, YouTube. Okay, our old internet is working again, so now I can listen to my music. 
this game has like ambient sound music. I wouldn't call it like music. I can't believe I was singing a song so much that Ruben even knew what the song was. <laughs> 350 hours on Destiny? That's a lot. I don't have that many. Are you hungry, Moby? I think Moby's hungry for lunch. Would love to see Fallout 76 on Stadia. Yeah. I ha That game was a huge disaster when it came out. Um, <laughs> but I would... Uh, I would try it if it came to Stadia. Just a sec, guys. Moby needs to go. Moby wants lunch, so I'm going to feed him. So just give me one second. Fantastic music, if I do say so myself. I like that. Do 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 do. That was cool. 
Um, okay, guys, I'm back. Moby has his food. We're set. Now, I see you guys talking about the Chromecast uh, and streaming from the Chromecast. That is true, what you said, Kid Bang Ring, but you can't have audio. You can't have voice overlay. So you can live stream your gameplay, but there is no way to have your mic set up. So for people who want to do a live stream, it's not really useful. That's what you and that's what you guys are talking about. You have a cat? I have two cats. Well, my mom has two cats, but they live with me. You're back, Chris. Welcome. Welcome. All right, guys, let's do this blue one. Um, again, I love to start off like this. Because you just get so many with one click. Boom. Easy. <laughs> Valley of plenty. All right, let's go. So it's just a lot of writing. And this island is actually pretty good for scrying. You haven't had a PC? Yeah, I highly recommend to start off with. I recommend a computer of any type and Stadia Direct Streaming. It, you, there's no webcam. It's just your voice and your game. People can come and chat. I think it's an awesome way to start. Um... I found it restricting because I was used to doing more. So it was kind of just like a stopgap, but it's the perfect place to start to find out if you like streaming. And if you like it, you can build from there. Like you can literally infinitely build it up from there. So totally try it, kid. Kid bangerang. <laughs> Rodney will be playing tonight. He'll be playing Destiny 2 tonight. Awesome. Oh, here's my thing. So if anybody's on, feel free to put your Stadia name in chat, Rodney, and um, people may add you, and then you guys can game together. Toss a coin to your Witcher. Yeah, yeah, that, that was on my playlist. So I have this, like, playlist, and all the songs I like, I put a thumbs up on, and then I listen to it. But, like, I always get obsessed with the newest songs. So after, like, ten songs, I go back to the start. So, like, every ten songs, I hear the Witcher song again. <laughs> Uh, and Meg basically made me want to try it since Stadia came out. You inspired me. Awesome, kid. Uh, yeah, I mean, I have a whole channel of just Stadia. Like, if you want a game, why not? I do it all the time. Moby, I just fed you. Fallout 76 has got loads better with the updates. Yeah. Updates are free too. So many games are like that. Cyberpunk is like that. Anthem is like that. Fallout 76 was like that. Moby, go lay down. I just give you food. Oh my god, he's so cute. Um, Alright, let's look around for our random loot. Now I just know why it's called hard mode, the first lover easy. Now I'm where it's at. <laughs> there you go, Unitrix. That's what you get for bragging about how easy hard mode is for you. Direct YouTube streaming with Bomb once they integrate OBS or similar programs to it. They won't, though. Um, That's called... That's... that They can't. That's, that's called using an encoder. Like... They, they either just, like, I don't think they will, to be honest. Um, the other streaming platforms, direct streaming, are very bare bones. And I think that's what Stadia will be. A way to get started, a way to share with your friends. But if you want to be a streamer, like, you're going to have to get the stuff. Derek Flores, how are you? Haven't played Elder Scrolls Online yet, but very interested. Check out my videos. Um, this isn't, like, an exciting inter... <laughs> this is kind of like a... Here's what you can do during your downtime of Elder Scrolls, like, and make money. Um, but I do lots of dungeon, check out my other videos, because I do lots of dungeon runs and actual gaming in the game. To this morning is just, like, a chill stream. So there is lots more to the game than what you'll see in this stream. But thank you for stopping by and hanging out. Welcome, Derek. So we're learning, we're getting artifacts right now, basically. 
And we have to play this little mini game to like figure out where they're located. I feel like we can hit like all of these. Er. <clears throat> that actually went kind of badly, but whatever. On green ones, I don't really pay attention. <laughs> I just got four of my gamer friends to join Stadia and we stream. Awesome. <laughs> it's all oh, it's so cool. There's so many like so many I'm hearing so many of those stories of people who are actually getting into Stadia now. So many people thought it was bad for so long. I've been streaming Stadia for a year. It's actually been great the whole time. <laughs> Psych, it's been great the whole time. <laughs> Love your channel. I hasn't found many Stadia streamers. Oh my god, Derek. There's a there's an awesome streaming like YouTube Stadia community. Um, if you go to my channel, check out featured featured channels. I think, um, and those are some of my good friends. And also, we all stream Stadia content a lot. So make sure you check that out. <laughs> this crying is horrible. <laughs> Whatever, Dren. You have I have like. <laughs> You have benefited from my scrying through gold, so. <laughs> so let's use our little thing. Okay, so it's, it's back here. Up here? Oh, there it is. Oh, yeah. See, it would have taken me so long to find this. <laughs> Thank you, Derek. <laughs> Witcher 3 on Stadia, I would love. I never played it. Don't judge me. I found the song from the Netflix. Um, but I would totally play it if it came to Stadia. Oh my god, it could be right in the middle. Ah! Oh! Hey, Derek! Thank you for joining! Wow! Guys, a sponsor thing! I I never even customized it. Thank you, Derek. Welcome to the Megabytes. Everybody, welcome Derek Flores, who joined the Megabytes. Thank you very much. Um, keep your eye out on the membership tab, Derek, because there's going to be a poll um, for what date we have our members-only live stream. Our first. I've only had members for a month, so it's going to be fun. Um, and enjoy the emotes made by the one and only Chris. Um, hey, thank you for the $10 donation, Derek. Thank you so much. No, thank you. <laughs> thank you so much for the support. It means a lot to me. Um, it actually means a lot, a lot, a lot to me right now. So, oh, <laughs> Oh God, there it is. There is my dog Moby, who's super cute. That was him at the beach in the summer a few years ago. Um, so thank you. Thank you, Derek. I, uh. I really appreciate it. <laughs> it's so good. I hear good things about Witcher, guys. I will, yeah, Mark, if it comes to Stadia, I'll definitely play it. Witcher 3 and Skyrim. That's like games that people want people to, to get. Detective Wu is your Stadia name. All right, send me, um, if you want, send me a, a friend request and I'll accept. My is my state of name is just Megatron X. Okay. I think it's like right here. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> I circled it. <laughs> Save up money for that Cyberpunk 27. Yeah, I love that game. Thank you, detective. Welcome. I don't want to click on messages. <laughs> it's people, I don't know. I haven't scanned them to make sure that all my messages are safe for public consumption. <laughs> um, I love Cyberpunk. I actually voted Cyberpunk as my favorite game to release in 2020 on Stadia. <laughs> Even though it was a mess on other platforms, it is fantastic um, on Stadia. Top five games you want on Stadia this year? I mean, that I don't know. That's too hard. Like, <laughs> there's a bunch of games I want on Stadia, but I don't think they're coming out this year. Like Elder Scrolls Six, or like games that make no sense to be on Stadia, like Fable, <laughs> which won't be. That'll be Xbox exclusive, obviously. But like, all my games are just stupid that I would want to have. Or like The Sims, like. <laughs> But not The Sims, like, The Sims 5, where it's, like, online and we can play with our friends. Um, 
that's my hope that they may I have literally ever since the Sims one I've been like the next one will be online and we can play with our friends and every single time it's single player so I just keep hoping like I want to go to my friend's house and steal their stuff you know um so I just play Sims and Elder Scrolls what are some other GTA GTA okay that's my first that's my first real pick would be GTA um the remastered version that they're bringing to next gen platforms that's I would like that um I want to say Skyrim but honestly I have Skyrim on enough platforms that I don't even need it on Stadia at this point but Skyrim is probably my all-time favorite game Monster Hunter World Witcher 3 would be a good one um Resident Evil kid Resident Evil I would love on Stadia I, people have requested me to play that more than any game except maybe GTA I feel like I say that's my most requested game to a lot of games but it's definitely like GTA and Resident Evil that people want to see the most <laughs> if you want to steal your friend's stuff then play Ark really <laughs> can I raid people's like houses and take their stuff <laughs> I might play Ark. Have you guys played Ark? Do you recommend I play it? Witcher was a big problem for Cyberpunk. Dude, that the expectations for a superb game were just too high. Ah, causing messes everywhere. I see. Always dangerous when some studio makes a fantastic game. I see. Okay. Maybe that's part of why I wasn't like on um, as aware of this the reasons for all the Cyberpunk um, hype was because it was the same company that did the rich the Witcher. I didn't think about the effect that would have on you rabid Witcher fans. Resident Evil 5 would be dope. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That would be amazing. I would to I would love to play Resident Evil. I haven't played it, but I've seen like clips of people playing. I don't like scary games, but I can see like I can see the appeal now. Having played Dead by Daylight and Doom, I can see the appeal of scary games now. You do recommend I play it, Unitrix? Okay. I'll check it out. I feel like it'll be a pro game when it comes to Stadia. So I'll, I'll check out all pro games. I just claimed my pro games this morning, guys. Don't forget to claim your games. Okay, I think it's right here. Right here? What the hell? It's got to be right here. Right here. Yeah. That was... That was badly done. They do, yeah. Ark is free to play on Pro Meg. Always easier to try it. What, right now? It's not out now, is it? Is it? No. And online you can build clans and make alliances. That's cool. Is that the one with the dinosaurs? Is that the one where there's dinosaurs that you live with or monsters or something? I'll play it. I don't care. Not yet. Oh, but it comes to pro when it launches on CD. Okay, okay, okay. There you go. Yeah. I was saying, like, I think I, that's why I was like, I feel like it's going to be pro. Hey, Paul D. What's up? A resident evil village announcement tonight with news and more footage yeah paul so somebody was telling me about a resident evil event today those of you who know about resident evil what are the chances they announced that it's coming to stadia today possible it may have been hard mode but that was easy it's a dinosaur game okay yes i will play arc do you guys want me to stream it do you want me to play? Do you? Okay. All right. Do you guys want me to do a first look video and then post it? And then it was Luke. Luke was telling me about the Resident Evil event. So Luke and Paul, what do you guys think the chances are that they announce it comes to Stadia? Because I would love that. 
Um, do you guys want me to do a video first look of ARC and then post it so it's just me talking about the game? Or do you want me to stream it so I can talk to you guys at the same time? Now, put your answers in chat and I'm going to take Moby out to pee because he's whining again. I know, I'm sorry. Um, but I'll be right back and I'll let you guys look at this super nice view. All right. Burb. is awesome like i because i haven't been streaming i haven't listened to my own be right back music and um that's great <laughs> i love that music <laughs> okay guys <laughs> welcome captain nice to see you here in the stream again do all the streams <laughs> i'll do them all <laughs> You only have one bullet. Stream it? You guys want me to stream it? Okay. We'll stream ARC together. Pizza, how are you? How's it going? Dark Bites, how are you, Louie? Nice to see you. <laughs> you would moan too if you had to pee. <laughs> Resident Evil come to Stadia. I love... I don't love scary games, but I love that you guys love them, so I play them for y'all. See, that's my American. <laughs> Thank you, Chris. Reckon this year. You think? I would love to see it. I would love to. Wilson, how are you? Nice to see you, Wilson. How have you been? Are you working? Oh, wait, guys. We're done. We're done about... No, I decline. Or I confirm. Okay. So, if you look at our Ebonheart pack list, Balfoyan is now done as saying I got the purple. We did the three green and we did the three blue. These hidden entries I have to find elsewhere somehow in another way in the future. I don't know how. So now we're going to go to the next one, which is Bleak Rock. Look, guys. 
We have a lead for a brazier of frozen flame. So this is an actual item I can put in my house. So let's go get this next and then we'll put it in my house and you guys can help me decide where I put it. That's in Bleak Rock. So I'm going to go to my guild and see if anyone is in Bleak Rock for a free trip. No, they're not. <laughs> so we will travel there manually. <laughs> Bleak Rock Isle. Oh yeah, I remember this place. I've been here before. Solo travel. Lily says, I started playing this the other day. I have too many games to play. <gasps> I know, so do I. I have way too many. Um, This game is like my current kind of focus, I would say. Like, I play this every day, no matter what. I used to, it used to be Red Dead. I play Red Dead every day, no matter what. But now it's this game, um, and that's why I'm streaming this, even though it's downtime. And people seem to not mind. Like I thought that it would be boring, so we'd only have like five or six people. But it seems like people like it, and you're chatting. So I'm happy I did it, like as a test, because um, I spend a lot of time offline, just kicking around, you know. Side quest on Cyberpunk ever end? <laughs> I'm trying to do all before the story end. They do technically, yes. They don't, like, respawn constantly. It is possible to finish them all. But there's a ton, Louis. There's a ton. I haven't done them all. Um, but I know some people in my chat who have done them all. Alright, guys. Let's get this golden one. Oh. Oh, it's difficulty ultimate. I can't do it. I can't do it. I need a higher level of scrying. I need five out of five. Look how close I am, though! Okay, we'll get it right away. We'll get it soon. Pipster, what's up? Ark is on approaches. Not yet, but when it does release, it will be a pro game. But it's not out yet. So, Pipster, that is the case. So keep an eye on your pro games because it will be coming up soon. Do we know what month that's coming out, guys? Do we know when that's happening? I don't know. But I will try it. Welcome, Pipster. Thank you for stopping by and chatting. I like your name. It's cute. <laughs> where, how did, where did it come from? It makes me think of, like, a nickname for Pippin <laughs> from Lord of the Rings. <laughs> or from the... Yeah, from Lord of the Rings. I was going to say from The Hobbit, but he no, he's from Lord of the Rings. All right. Too much blinding lights, Ruben said. I can't believe you guys can know what I'm listening to. <laughs> Maybe February? Maybe February. I hope for February because I'm kind of excited about this game now. You guys are making it sound pretty cool. Twenty twenty one could mean anything. Twenty twenty one is now. Now is twenty twenty one. I'm at level thirty four, fifty street could. Looking forward to seeing you in Night City when multiplayer comes out. So I've said before, I'm basically just killing time until Cyberpunk Online comes out. And then I'm pretty sure I'm going to just be a full-time Cyberpunk Online streamer. I'll mix in other games, but that's going to be my main focus. Right now, it's like, I guess Destiny. I streamed a lot of Destiny. Like, I streamed it one day, and then I streamed it the next, like, three or four days. <laughs> um, but I would say Destiny and this are the two games that I'm playing a lot of right now. Are you going to try WWE just for funsies? So WWE is free to play this weekend, if you guys don't know. So if you have a pro subscription and you're interested in trying WWE, which is wrestling, <laughs> it's free to try. So I could try it this weekend. Chris, if somebody streams it, I'll say this. If someone streams it, I may jump in their stream and try it. How's that? I don't plan to stream it myself, though. I don't think it really fits with my content. That's what I'm going to say. It doesn't fit with my... It doesn't artistically fit the confines of my channel. But really, I just don't want to play it. <laughs> I feel that my content is not 
my I feel that my channel would not benefit from that type of content. <laughs> no, I really just don't want to play. <laughs> I feel like a lot of people stop playing Stadia because Xbox and PlayStation VR headsets. Maybe. Um, I would say in the community, it doesn't seem like a lot of people abandon Stadia for console. But if you have Stadia already, then you're already kind of thinking outside the box. So I wasn't really surprised by that. But if anything, Stadia has grown a huge amount because of all the exposure it got from the Cyberpunk release. Wait a s- I don't see anything there. What the hell is that? Is it here? Oh, there we go. I hear banging around. But Meg, you have to grind to get good stuff in ARC. But if I enjoy it, I don't mind grinding. Like, I enjoy playing Red Dead, so I didn't mind grinding it, right? I grind a lot of games. I grind this game. Jeez. I grind this game a lot. I ran the same dungeon like 30 times with Dren one time. Thank you, Dren. <laughs> to get a Frost Staff I needed for my healer. Isn't WWE something Sunny will stream? Sunny will probably do WWE. Do it this weekend. Sunny, if you're thinking of streaming it, definitely do it this weekend. Because that way you can pick up people from chat who want to play with you. And they don't have to have the game. They just need pro. And, like, everyone has pro. Well, not everyone, but uh, many of our viewers have pro. Because we're all, like, Stadia heads. Got it! <laughs> Console short supply. Yeah, I see, I see things on Twitter and they're like... They can't get one. They're like trying to get a PlayStation and they can't get one. It's crazy. But the, I don't want to own hardware because it's going to be crappy in a few years. God. I'm such a Stadia like. Um, evan evangelist. <laughs> I was going to say evangelical, but. <laughs> All right, guys, let's do that. All right, and we have two more for this one. Boom! I think hard mode was easy and impossible is hard. Yeah, Unitrix, but you're not the regular player for that game. I know how much you play super hot. A lot, a lot. Oh, I rhymed. Oh, what did I rhyme last night about? Oh, um. About, what did I say? Oh my god, dollars and cents. What was it? Oh, pounds and cents. Oh my god, what was it? Together make pence. That makes sense. But it was so, like, it was like bars when I said it. <laughs> People are still struggling to get a PS5. I know! How have they not dealt with that situation? I don't see- I feel like I should see it. I don't see it. What the hell? Is it up there? No way. No way. I must have missed it. I don't want to have to like go climbing. All right, let's see. Oh yeah, no, it's this way. What the? How am I so wrong? How was I so wrong about that? Oh my God. <laughs> Pence and cents. Well, because Penny, like, I was like, thank you for your pound cent. And someone was like, it's not a pound cent, it's called a pence. And I said, oh, pound and cent together make pence. That makes sense. <laughs> right? Have you ever thought of that? <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> cool, Andy, what quote are you guys looking for? Quote 90, why'd you have to punch me in the face? Quote 95, time is irrelevant. What are you guys looking for? <laughs> hey! 
you guys chris wants a quote list and i refuse to give it to him look at him struggling look at him he's like so many quotes i know he's mad right now he's like meg make a quote list i'm like no i'm too lazy <laughs> and now he's like mad hey <laughs> ruben is lurking 102 did you guys make a quote of my rhyme if so i didn't notice it All right, guys, I really want to do another purple lead. <laughs> I added your Pence thing, but I don't know where you maniac. <laughs> I know exactly what you mean. Look at them just spamming. The, bo the bot is dead. You, The bot is like, F you. I'm not saying anything else. <laughs> I think she has a timeout spammer thing, so people can't spam it indefinitely. There it is, 97 Pound cents, pence. Oh my god, it makes sense. There we go. Yeah, pounds, cents, pence. Oh my god, it makes sense. Pounds and cents are pence. <laughs> Guys, I'm British. I'm allowed to have an opinion on these things. I should find my passport and show you guys. Um, But I'd have to cross out whatever the... Like, I'd have to black out the numbers, but... I could show you the outside, because I do have two. I felt so cool. I put them together, and I put them in a box, and I wanted to get, like, a stack of cash and, like, put it in the, like, because, you know, on the movies, there's always a spy, and they live undercover, and then shit happens, and they run into the closet and lift up the floorboard, and there's a box, and in it are a bunch of passports and money and a gun. So I wanted to, like, make that, but anyways, I just have two passports. So it's still kind of cool, though. Okay, we got the purple one. High King Sunstone. So this is 5,000. I have the new fancy one that lets me go in all the fast lines. The Nexus? I have that one. It's blue. It's dark blue. Although, it's not new anymore. It was new when I got it. Oh, God. <laughs> MC Meg Barzing. Yeah, I am. No. I don't have a gun, Ruben. I live in Canada. What the hell? You think I'm Amer- Just because I say y'all does not make me American. All the Americans are like, yeah. <laughs> Weirdo girl. There we go. You've got a blue one that's recent. Yeah. I should find it. It's in a box. It got boxed up after the fire. I almost lost it. I almost lost both my passports in the fire. Oh my god. Oh god, that would have been horrible. The hassle. The hassle. I'm having nightmares just thinking about it. Oh, where is this? Oh, here it is. Okay. Doesn't Canada have wild bears you need to protect yourself from? No. Maybe if you live in a cabin in the woods, you might want a hunting rifle for defense. But honestly, um, when I used to do a lot of stuff in the woods, I just had a can of mace with me for the bears and the rapists. Mm people are a much bigger danger than wild animals in Canada and our people are not that dangerous wait fire oh Sammy oh yeah you weren't around back in the days you weren't back in the days Sammy before we knew you come here Sonny and I'll tell you a story uh, Sammy, check my Instagram for some pictures of the fire. So I used to live in a place with wonderful internet, and I had a studio and everything I needed. It was like a luxury. It was amazing. A house. Um, and then there was a fire, and it burnt down, and I had to leave. And everything has just gone downhill since then. But finally... <laughs> so, and it, long story, it went on for months, and then COVID happened, and I've been trapped, and... Um, I've been moving around and then I had no internet and I had this channel and it was just crazy. But, um, um, 
now I have the fast internet and everything is better, but I'm still getting stuff back from the fire from insurance. So I have like, I'm literally right here when I'm like looking, that's a pile of boxes full of my stuff that I don't know what to do with. And I still have more coming that I have to figure out what to do with all this stuff. So for now, it's just in a box. <laughs> You inspired me to do some scrying. I just nailed two more golden digs and three perps. Awesome, Twisted. Yeah, I I get into it. I just get into the zone with scrying and I just scry and just chill out. It's fun. Yeah, Louis, I am. My dad was British and so I got my passport through him. But I am. I have my passport and everything, so I'm legit Brit. <laughs> Wouldn't it be cool if I had a British accent? I wish my dad still had his. Thought we'll try 10 Yeah, Chris, I haven't started experimenting yet. So after this stream, um, I'll start messing with things. But this was like my, this was supposed to be my wake up stream. So I haven't done any experimenting yet. Um, but I will try going to 1080, streaming in 4K. So streaming me in 4K and then outputting at 1080, I would like to do. But I also need to make sure I can still have my laptop on the Wi-Fi, have my mom be on the Wi-Fi, have her casting, have my iPad do something. So that's what I'm going to do this afternoon. High King Sunstone. So that's 5,000 gold. Chat, do you guys like that? Do you guys notice like, oh, Meg's only in 720. I wish I could watch this in 1080. Because I never cared, but now that I have faster internet, I've been watching everything in 1080, and it's amazing. And this game looks great. This this game always looked great, though, because I played on PC. But on Stadia and 4K, this game looks amazing. Four K Stadia gaming seems to be stable. The very yeah, yes. So we know I can game in four K. But see, here's the thing, Chris. If I have to pay in ten eighty p so that you guys can see in ten eighty p, I will. It, does that make sense? Like if I have to play it lower so you guys like if I have if I have to stream in four K if if I could stream in four K but you guys have to watch in seven twenty, I don't know. If, I don't know which I would do there. Because I don't know how important 1080 versus 720 over is for you viewers. I don't know. I can't tell. Like, I wish I could see what resolution people watch my videos in. But YouTube doesn't track that metric, sadly. The vampiric stained glass. I want that twisted. I want that stained glass. There's always a different dialects in Britain, everything is quite mixed now. Mm -hmm. That's true. There's a huge variety. Um, and a lot of our like Brit streamers that we have, or UK streamers, I want to include everybody. Um, yeah, they are wildly different how they sound. Most people watch on mobile, so it looks great on Sony. That's a good point. YouTube does tell me. And yeah, most people do watch my stuff on mobile. Still looks great on 720. That's true. On mobile, 720 is fine. But on PC, you're right. 1080 you need to have. Okay. That's a good point. You don't even know what I watch. <laughs> auto is a fine option as well, Ruben. I'll leave mine on auto now and it can just decide for me. Wow. That was a huge... That was a huge one. There we go. I see everything in 4K due to wearing glasses. Nice, Luke. Oh, who wanted to see me in my glasses? Chris, here. Some people wanted to see me in my glasses. So. <laughs> what do you guys think? <laughs> Would you watch me in glasses? <laughs> <laughs> those are my glasses they're red on the inside and blue on the outside <laughs> nerd you're a nerd 
Oh, guys, look who's in chat. It's Phil. Oh, my God. Phil, hi. Guys, X Phil, okay, Phil also, Phil has his own command, which I think is still active. Phil, we haven't seen you here in ages. I literally played Crucio last night. You should have jumped in. Phil is my first mod ever. Um, back from the Fortnite days. <laughs> I, how did you come in right when I was putting on stupid glasses? <laughs> but yeah, those are my glasses. <laughs> Phil's the OG mod, don't get on his bad side, that's right. <laughs> I totally forgot. I gave Chris a- I was like, Chris, you're the exception, I'll give you a command, but I totally forgot about Phil's. How have you been? <laughs> We're scrying. It's not fun, but it's something. I mean, actually, it is like I'm having fun to sit silently and do this for hours is not that fun um but I'm having a really good time <laughs> it's way more fun to stream it I should always do this I just thought you guys would be bored <laughs> UK people be all like all right love how's the doing <laughs> I didn't okay all right love how's the doing <laughs> you what mate hello God, I hate doing the accents. Guys, how am I going to roleplay? Okay, so <laughs> streamers play like sandbox games like GTA and then they like have fake like voices and they do fake like they do roleplay and people it's like super popular and people want us to do it and Link and I we like have this we we constantly have this idea that we're gonna do it, but we haven't found the right game and the right setup and all this stuff. But I don't know how this is gonna work because I can't do accents and every time I try to do it, everyone tells me to shut up. So I like all you Brits uniting in chat. <laughs> Ow. I hope people don't look too closely at the cam. Obviously you do. But I just wish no one really looked at it. <laughs> you feel so alone now with Brexit? Oh my god. Like, I try not to comment too much on the politics or happenings of other countries. Or my country, to be honest. I try not to. But I will just say that I was shocked <laughs> at Brexit. But America is shocking. Everywhere is shocking. I mean, but I was shocked. Brexit? What? How did that even happen? I didn't- I, I should watch that movie that they made about it with Benedict Cumberbatch. I wonder if that's a- I wonder if that's an accurate representation of what happened. Probably not, because it's a movie. There it is. Hey, Unitrix! So are you just kicking it, kicking butt? <laughs> you what, mate? <laughs> you what? <laughs> Left hand doesn't know what the right hand's doing here in UK. I hear a lot of that, you guys. Like, I always thought that UK was just basically, like, the Canada of Europe. Um, but we're, so, we're so different. And the same with America. I learned so much about America and Americans, and I'm learning so much about Brits and the United Kingdom. It's crazy. <laughs> Brits and Britannia is like, Americans in America and Brits in Britannia. That's what I. That's what I was like about to say, and I was like, "That's not right." <laughs> but we got one bonus treasure there. <laughs> All right, guys. So I keep getting these pop-ups, but I the game looks fine. I don't think it's gonna die. Um, but I hear some. I hear other people have the same issue where it will pop up and say something's wrong, but everything goes fine. All right, let's do this.
my god, I'm the scrying master! I'm the best. I can just, I can scry all day. I will. I am. It's happening. Oh, this one is up on an, like a, an island. All right, let's fast travel. Let's well, fast. This is a tiny island, but everything in UK goes in a sandwich. Pies, pot noodles, you name it. If it fits, it goes in a sandwich. <laughs> what? So you make sandwich out of other food? <laughs> well, you've had the Brexit. Now time for the twixt it. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> Okay, bye, Twisted. If you're saying bye for real, bye. Or if you're saying bye just for your Brexit, then fake bye. <laughs> Alright, let's go get this. Hey, Chase! Oh my god, Chase! Yeah! I got the thick internet. It came to me. So, it's my same internet company, but they we heard that they were working on the lines and upgrading them. And we heard down the street it was closer, so we were like, oh my god, it's coming. And then they finally emailed us, and they were like, we have faster speeds in your area. And it was like, it was on the 20th yesterday? Is that true? Is that true? Was it yesterday that I got the internet? And then Hitman was out. Hitman came out at 9 o'clock, and the, the internet office opened at 8.30. So I woke up early, Chase, yesterday, and I called them, and I was like, hello, like, my name is Louise, because I had to be my mom, and I was like, um, I'd like the fast internet, please, and they were like, done! So I went on my computer, and, well, I restarted the modem, went on my computer, I had the speeds, so I have 50 down, like 5, 0, and 10 up. More than enough for what I need. So I'm now I'm gaming in 4K. I'm streaming. I got my face all over everything. People love it mostly, except some people don't. But overall, it's been great. <laughs> so I'm just here chilling. I'm not even doing anything. We're just hanging out and I'm running around and we're, in, we're just hanging out and chatting and it's great. Thank you, Chase. Me too. It feels great. I know you have like <sighs> internet struggles also in a different way, but also frustrating with internet and good things come to those who wait and good things come to those who limp along as best they can while they wait for good things to happen so we're doing what we can chase sending positive vibes yeah it totally happened it did help and it's actually great because i don't need to do starlink which was like five or six hundred dollars or like six or seven hundred dollars for like the receiver plus a hundred dollars a month or whatever for the service this we didn't even have to install anything she literally just typed in fast internet and we were off it was amazing i can't believe that was yesterday so i streamed hitman and then yeah f those scrubs f those haters <laughs> so i did hitman in the morning from nine till whatever and then i had a break and then i did trash mob at nine o'clock that night and then I streamed Crew 2 that night until, like, 2.30 in the morning. And then I cut it off because I'm good now. I have a sleeping schedule now. And I try to keep to it. But it was really fun. But, yeah. Crew was fun. We should play. We should play again. Chris helped me level up to Icon status so I can do my weekly Platinum bonus for extra XP. Listen to me, Chris, sounding like I know things about Crew 2. <laughs> sleep, what's that, right? We don't sleep around here. It was really messing it up me up, though, guys. And it was hard to, like... It was messing up my relationships with other people because I couldn't be around when they were conscious. And it was it's weird for my mom to have such weird hours so that she never knows if I'm asleep or awake or getting up or going to bed, right? So I was like, all right, I need to regulate this a little bit so I can actually exist as a human in society. As much as I want to shun society and always live on Meg time zone. Guys, was Blackie Ray here and say hi and I miss his message? Where the hell is this thing? 
It's got to be right here. Yeah. There we go. Sleep, what's that? It's funny, when I started playing Red Dead, are you going to stream Crew 2 occasionally now or just once or twice a year? I don't know. I, I had a lot of fun. So if I could have like a, a, a group of one or two people that I played with. Like, how good are those rewards that we get from the weekly thing, Chris? Because I could just log on. I could go. I could maybe do once a week. Maybe I could pick an evening in the week to do it. <coughs> and then have like a nightly crew. But some people already do that, so... Maybe just occasionally, Chris. Like, maybe one week I'll jump on someone's stream, and then next week I'll stream it, and then another week I'll just do it. So I'll try to do it, but I'm not going to say I'm going to stream crew every week. I was gone for precisely 6 minutes and 45 seconds. How do you know that? Did you pause the stream and then come back and then check to see how long it had to go to catch up to be live? <laughs> Because I know how long I've been away from things when I do that. Like, I used to watch YouTube in my car in the summer. And then I'd come inside. And I knew it would take me exactly a minute and 20 seconds to get from my car inside. Because I would pause. Usually Link's live stream, I would pause it. And then go inside and unpause it. And it was always like a minute and 22 seconds. <coughs> Sorry, guys. The dry air in the in the winter makes me kind of like sick all the time. You can be all like playing crew with my crew. Yeah, Luke. <laughs> Occasionally it's fine when you feel like having such a right, Chris? Exactly. So I will aim for maybe monthly. Monthly crew streams. Cause yeah, once or twice a year isn't enough for that fun of a game. D crew two deserves some love. Oh, this is gonna be This will be a good one. Oops. Ugh, oh, I effed it up. But it's still going to be good. There we go. Boom. <sighs> Something so satisfying about scrying. Meg, are you a dog person or a cat person? Or maybe even both. I am a both person, Unitrix. But I lean more towards dog. Um... <laughs> um, I am mostly a dog person I have a dog Moby who's my baby um, I was not a pet like parent I, was, I always thought I would be a pet owner until I got a puppy and then I was like I'm totally a dog mom and he's my dog baby <laughs> so he is my baby I do baby him a lot and he's, like, the most important thing to me. We've been through a lot together, so. Um, he's a really, he's really good. He's really, really sensitive. So if I get upset or if, like, mom gets upset or if even if we're just telling a story, like, passionately, like, if I'm telling mom a story about something that in on stream that got me really frustrated or whatever, Moby will, like, sense that we're in distress and he'll come over and, like, and like want pets and lean on you and like snuggle you to try to make you feel better like he's so cute um but i do like cats also my mom has a couple cats but like i don't i don't i don't see i uh, cats are okay i don't i don't go out of my way to have a cat or be around cats so i would say i'm a dog person but i like cats i like snuggling them and petting them and they're cute meg when you streaming dead by daylight again i don't know wilson um it's certainly on my radar, though. I like to play that. And people actually requested another Brit edition. Because I played um, I played Dead by Daylight with Gem and Twisted. And people really liked that. And they were like, we want to see you with the Brits. <laughs> um, so yeah, I might do Dead by Daylight again soon. 
Especially now with this internet, I can do what I want. Um, but it'll probably be at night. Like, I feel like after dark. I, it should be after dark for me to do Dead by Daylight. My cat, whenever I don't give him attention, he touches my leg politely and asks to be stroked. That's cute. These cats meow. Like, one... Bella. We call her Bella Oakenstump because she's thick. And she just sits like this. And glares. And glares. And wants food. And that's all she does is just glare at us and want food. Um, but she can be sweet. Like, when she sleeps, she's cute. Um, and then Mavis is the killer. And she, uh, she kills mice all the time. In fact, when I took Moby out just now, there's a dead mouse. Chopped up. I won't go into any more graphic detail. But it's not like a whole mouse. It's like pieces. And it's on the doormat. So that's nice. But she's a killer. Um, but she's cute. And she will meow. Like she came into my room this morning and meowed. To ask for treats. But I told her no because I don't feed her treats. <clears throat> I let her out of the house. That's it. And I feed her food if it's empty. But I let mom handle like the treats and stuff. New internet goes zoom. That's right crew. Or crew. That's right Luke. <laughs> It is actually amazing. I do have to go do tests. How long have I been streaming? What time is it? Where are we? <laughs> what is life? <laughs> Where's my time on this thing? What the hell? How come YouTube doesn't tell me how long I've been streaming? Things have changed. Two hours, 25 minutes. Okay, that's a good... That's a nice stream. Things have changed on YouTube since I streamed. <clears throat> so I don't always know what's happening. Okay, that's good. All right, so we'll wrap up, like, before Mom gets home. So I can go start doing tests before she gets here. Because I don't want to interrupt her internet any more than I have to. Although, to be honest, I've done it so much, she probably doesn't care at this point. All right, we'll do a blue one. That's easy. So there are, like, when you first start scrying, it's a lot more simple than this. But it gets hard pretty quick, and you have to put a ton of points into it. Like, skill points for this game. And <laughs> that's what I did. I put, like, 25 points into it for her. So now it's kind of easy. Like, it's OP. You probably need the two internet connections for Mommy Tron. We'll see. Um... Because they asked us when I called if they wanted us to upgrade the other line, too. It would be nice just to have one. But if two is what we need to, like, everybody just be have what they need, then I think that's okay. <clears throat> but if the 50 can do everything, then why? Why have a second one? The only thing is that I don't think we can both necessarily... I don't know if we can both play Stadia. I think we can both play Stadia at the same time, but... Maybe not in, like, 4K. Like, we may have to both be in 1080p. <laughs> hey, Chris. How are you doing? Oh, can I call you Chris? Or do you like Christopher? Late on this. Been working. No worries, buddy. Thank you for stopping by. Everything is well. Everything is amazing. I'm, like, on cloud nine. These... I was going to say these last few days, but it was l literally just y yesterday I got the internet. But, yeah, I'm super happy. Chris is fine. Okay. Do stress test. Do a stress test, like do a stream while she's... Yeah, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to stream. I guess I'm going to put it in 1080p. Then I'm going to stream. Then I'm going to load my, uh, my stream on my laptop. Then I'm going to Chromecast the stream to the TV. Because that's how mom likes to watch. When I stream, she likes to watch the stream cast onto the TV. And then I'm going to, like, run uh, something on my iPad. Run something on my phone. And see, okay, where does it start to break down? Like, where does it get pixelated? What Does it interrupt my stream? Because <clears throat> if, if all we can do is, like, Stadia stream and cast something, that's fine. We can probably manage that. So we have to see. We just have to see what, what how it goes. 
but that'll be what I do after. But I'd rather sit here and talk to you guys and scry than do a bunch of tests that could end up meaning I have to pay twice as much for my internet. <laughs> Would be cool if you both can play ESO together. We have! So, we played together. We played together on PC. She has it on PC. And I have it on PC. So we played together that way. And we've done dungeons. Me, Chris, or not Chris, me, Matt, Dren, and Mom did dungeons. And maybe with Twisted. Did Twist leave? Twist, did you ever do a dungeon with my mom? I can't remember if we did one with him or not. But yeah, she did great. My mom is legit. There it is. Everything okay, Chris? Just eating a banana? Oh, you're talking to each other about what you're doing. Okay, I was like, <laughs> what is it with Chris and bananas? <laughs> I have this thing I've, where I always make fun of him having to Google how to peel a banana. Because, <laughs> like, we're, what were we talking about? Who knows? We talk about such stupid stuff. But he was like, yeah, it's, oh, the Google Assistant. He's like, yeah, I want to ask the Google Assistant to show me a video about how to peel a banana. And I was like, do you need a video for that? Like, not that I want to be judgmental. I mean, I guess if you need help, you need help. But I was like, really, Chris? Like, you don't know how to peel a banana? He's an adult. <laughs> what do you think will be the Stadia Pro game next month? Journey to the Savage Planet. I would love that, Paul. I would love Journey to the Savage Planet. Um, <clears throat> I don't know. People always ask. I don't know. I'd have to look and kind of see what games they announced. Um, Stadia recently announced like a month ago announced a whole bunch of like a group of seven indie games that are coming and figment i think was one of them and that was a pro game this month so i expect to see one of those ones they announced coming up next month i hope we get a really good month because february is kind of depressing to me at least march is the worst 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 i hate march maybe more than any other month of the year um <clears throat> So I'm hoping that we get something good in March. But February can be depressing too. So I hope they give us I hope they give us a good game, not just a bunch of like little indie games. This month I was not excited. All right guys, I think we're done this zone. Evan Hart, Balfoyan, we're done. Yeah. So let's go to Bleak. Oh, I'm done Bleak. Oh yeah, right. I'm done Bleak. Deshaun, I'm done. East March I'm not done. So let's go to East March. Is there somebody in East March? No. Damn it. No one is everywhere I need them to be. Fine. We'll pay to travel. <clears throat> oh, my God. Maybe there was somebody there and I just didn't see the marker for it. All right. <laughs> uh, hey, Louie. <laughs> oh my god, I have so many zones to cover. In this game? I have a lot to do in this game. We were talking it. Oh, we were talking about YouTube Primo, how annoying it is to get ads if you just want to quickly watch a video on how to peel a banana. So I just see, like, I just see Chris at his house, right? And he's got, like, a banana. And, like, he has limited time to eat it. He's like, I only have a minute and a half to eat this banana. I don't know how to get into it. So he's frantically on YouTube, like, how to peel a banana. And he's like, yes, this is the perfect video. It's only 30 seconds long. And he clicks on it, and boom, there's an ad. And now he's like, no, I don't have time to eat my banana. Like, why is this a crisis? Anyways, that's just how I imagine Chris freaking out about his banana. <clears throat> I really need to start spicing Valentine's Update a little and making it romantic. And feeding each other with slingshots? What the hell, Luke? <laughs> that was nice until that part. So far I did Stonefalls and then doing the wrist, the rift, because I am even Eben packed. I think I'm saying that right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You are. Um Eben Heart Packed. Eben Heart Packed, yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm working through all the zones. I'm just starting at the top and going down. So I have the Eben Heart Packed. Then Western Skyrim apparently has its own line. And then DLC areas. Look at all these. I have to go through all these areas. 
I guess these places have their own. Ieve? I don't even know what that is. I don't even know how to get there. I don't know. You just ordered a Calzone. Nice. What game is this? This is Elder Scrolls Online Hunter. Also, hi. Nice to see you. I haven't seen you in a while. <laughs> this is cool because um, I used to stream at this time all the time. So we're seeing some of like the old faces, the OGs of the channel. So guys, a lot of you probably don't know Hunter. How are you, Hunter? Um, Hunter was my first ever person to chat in my chat. <laughs> when I first started streaming, guys, <clears throat> it wasn't like it is now. I didn't know anybody and nobody knew me. Um, I, I watched Twitch, but nobody knew me on Twitch, like as a viewer even. I didn't, I was too shy to chat. So I started streaming on YouTube and I had no viewers and no one talked in my chat. Nobody came by to the stream. So I streamed the first few weeks just talking to nobody. <laughs> and then one day at the end of my stream, I never looked at chat because I never had anybody watching me. At the end of my stream, I saw I had a message that was like, hey, and it was Hunter. And I was like, somebody talk to me somebody talk to me on the internet um and i didn't even see his message and i felt so bad so the next day i watched chat like compulsively i was literally like waiting and he came back and he said hi again and so i said hi hunter so we anyway so he was my first ever chatter and he when i streamed fortnite he would come by all the time and so he was my first ever mod so it's nice to see you back hunter <laughs> would love no man's sky yeah so no man's sky Oh, no. I'm thinking of Journey to the Savage Planet. <clears throat> um, not Journey. Journey to the Savage Planet is coming. No Man's Sky would love to see. Link also wants to see that. I have No Man's Sky and I tried it and I couldn't get into it. But I think with people, I think with people, it would be better. You guys are laughing at me. It is funny. Now, if you're known in the community, is, is Phil your first modern hunt? That's true. I do call them both my first mod. Okay. Technically, Phil is the first mod. The first person that I hit mod on was Phil. But Phil was a mod before my channel even launched. Okay. Hunter was my first mod that I met on the internet, got to know, and then modded as a, as a mod in the wild. Okay. So... Hunter was my first wild mod, okay? Phil was my first mod, I have to say, truthfully. Like, he was a mod before my first stream, even. So, it was Phil. He's still here. He's like, me! I'm the first I'm the first mod. He is, he is. But Hunter is the first wild mod, okay? <clears throat> and all mods since have been wild. Except Ishan. Uh. <laughs> is your... <f> <laughs> Starbucks. Nice. Yeah, I have a coffee. I have iced coffee. <coughs> Which I'm choking on now. Caramel latte. Oh my god, nice. Are you getting it delivered or are you out right now, Chase? A wild mod appeared. Yeah. <laughs> so that's the truth. I love how Chris is like, everybody can't be your first mod, Meg. Chris, you're my main mod right now, okay? And you have been for a while, and you know that. My MM. East March. Okay, let's scry. We found that already. But that wasn't worth 5,000. <laughs> the other mods are like, Pokemon's Meg just catches them in the wild. Gotta catch them all! <laughs> yeah. I like my mods... <clears throat> like, I mod my own chat, and I find as a streamer you have to. Unless it's crazy busy. But I like to be able to say, like, mods, like, will some mod put this link in chat? Or, you know what I mean? And know somebody will be there to help me. And you always are. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Phil was the first mod, okay? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. He was the O he's the OG. <laughs> you asked for sugar and then come to give you no hunter. <laughs> I can't drink coffee without sugar in it. Ugh, ah, ah. Or at least I suppose no, I could actually. But I do not want to drink coffee without cream. Let me tell you. If I had to pick either sugar or cream to go in my coffee, I would pick cream every time. Not even a contest. <laughs> there we go. After this, I'm going to do a test stream and turn my music on as loud as possible and dance around my house in happiness while I do all my tests. <laughs> so that's what you guys can envision me doing <laughs> after this. <laughs> all right, let's go. <clears throat> Some mod among us is the imposter, says uni. <laughs> oh my god, yeah, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> Black coffee for the wind, get out. You're right, you agree, Hunter? Yeah. So how have things been with you, Hunter? Yeah. Unitrix wants a Fortnite stream. So I could hypothetically do a Fortnite stream. I'd have to set up my PlayStation and my capture card and everything, but I want to do it. And it would be unlisted, so like... I would stream it, and then once it was over, you wouldn't see it on my channel anymore. So Unitrix, if we did it, we'd have to make sure that you're able to be there. Because <clears throat> my channel is technically Stadia only. <laughs> but I will make an exception for Fortnite, because that was the shit. I was, okay, so before Red Dead, before Division, before Destiny, before all of it, I was a Fortnite addict. I was addicted to Fortnite. I played it every day. I earned all the V-Bucks. I did all the missions. I had all the care. I was the best. Like, oh my god. At, 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 at the PvE. Not Battle Royale. I'm not talking about Battle Royale. I don't play Battle Royale. I suck too much. I'm just being honest. But Save the World, which is like, Orcs Must Die basically. I was the best. Hey! Big Eddie Bear is here. Mods, drop that Drop that big Eddie Bear command in chat for me, please. How are you doing, Eddie? What's up, home, homie? Home slice? My homeboy? We we can... Eddie likes f funny names. <laughs> Guys, I really effed this up. <laughs> oh, that was lucky because it could have been over here. Who do you think the imposter is? I actually think the imposter is Sammy because he's the most recent person I modded. <laughs> so I say Sammy. <laughs> Thank you, Chris. <laughs> you play this, don't you, Eddie? Maybe you don't. I don't see you in the guild, actually. In the UK, we say... What's going on, fam? Fam! <laughs> Nothing much, homie. Trying to finish my hot dog where I have to call this customer back. Oh, you're working and eating a hot dog. I like one of those things and not the other. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm sure you all know which is which. <laughs> da, 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 da. We're just scrying. This is a chill stream where we just scry and talk. And so far, I've been, I've, I think it's great. And I'm really pleased with myself. Oh, did I just get a notey? <clears throat> and this morning, I wanted to do this. And, like, I wanted to do this. Not really your type of game? I find that surprising. Because you game with Eddie and Link so much. And I know they have been, in they have been into this game. Not right now, but... Okay. I've tried and I'm sure I will try again. What about Skyrim? Did you like Skyrim? Megan, save the world. You're gonna people can go over level 130 now, Hunter. Don't tell me that, guys. I grind. So in Save the World, 130 is max level. I grinded to get that. And I did it right as I achieved it 
<clears throat> like as my addiction was ending. It was like hitting 130 was like as I left Fortnite behind to be become totally Stadia invested. So I just have this account with everything on it. It's max level. I have all everything. Um, and I'm not even playing the game anymore. But they raised the cap, Hunter is saying. So maybe I'll have to, maybe I'll plug, you know what? I have the fast internet in. Maybe I'll plug it in and do the updates and stuff. At least it's not calling a hot dog and eating a customer. <laughs> and at least you're not calling the customer while your mouth is full of hot dog. <laughs> so you work from home, Eddie? Oh, I think he can't. I'm trying to like talk to him about all these things and he's literally working, but. Sangfam is used mercilessly said even over here. But I only use it sparingly. But I hear it amongst teenagers. <laughs> That's funny. It's 144 now. Interesting. Instead of 130. <coughs> wants, not what's. It seems like Meg wants to play Fortnite. Of course I do. I want people to see that Fortnite is not um is not battle royale fortnite is actually another whole game and no one under no one understands me <laughs> everybody's like meg you love PUBG because you played fortnite and i'm like no when you say fortnite when i say fortnite i mean orcs must die basically is what fortnite is and then the bat the p the battle royale mode the pvp is like PUBG. it's like a actual battle royale and I'm tired of explaining it to people, so I want to stream it and show them what it is. And then when we talk about Fortnite, I can link the video and say, go and look at what I'm talking about. The last few years. Oh, nice, Eddie. That is so cool. PUBG is better than Fortnite. I'm talking about Save the World. Oh, Ashes, why would you come in here just to make me angry? Except for the world PvE. There we- Thank you, Ashes. Thank you for your disclaimer. You're right, Meg. Thank you, Hunter. So, Big Eddie Bear, have you played the Battle Royale mode of Fortnite or the Save the World? Because Save the World, I shit you not, it's Orcs Must Die, but better! <laughs> Just to see you get angry. Guys, can we ban the trolls, please? Mods? Are there any mods here to help me? God. I'm just kidding. Don't ban him. Remember, who did we ban that time? Chris, who was that? That I was like, can we ban this person? But I was just kidding. And then he got timed out. Don't time out Ashes or Eddie. <laughs> You've only played Battle Royale Unitrix. Save the world is awesome. Go okay, Unitrix. See, I have to stream it as a public service announcement to the gaming world. Because I'm cracked. Both. I played Fortnite when I was still in beta. <sighs> okay. There's a lot more to it now. Why is this so far from me? Look how far that is from me. If I travel to Direfrost Keep, can I turn around and walk out the door and be there? Or is it going to send me back here? It's charging me to go there, so I think I can actually go there. Like a waypoint. Let's try it for science. Um, they've changed so much. I started playing Fortnite, Eddie, when Fortnite... <clears throat> it wasn't in beta. But it was, like, there were no skins. There was no team. It was only solo. There was no teams. There was no skins. Like, when you joined, you just randomly got assigned a person. Um, and people killed, there was team killing, um, when they finally did announce teams and we could finally team up with each other. We were so excited because up till then we'd just been playing solo. Um, and we were so excited. And so we would team up with people. And every time I got the scar, which is the best weapon in the game, they would kill me and take it. And I couldn't figure out why I kept getting killed by my teammates. And I didn't like for, I didn't like it because it was dumb. And eventually... Um, Epic actually hired the toxicity was so bad early on they hired a company to do like an analysis and help them deal with the toxicity in the game because the game was taking off um, but the the culture around it was really negative 
and the company said you have to end you have to turn off team killing because that's where it was coming from so they did and now there's friendly fire and once they or then now there's no friendly fire once they change that way better way better then you had to work with your team um and i was the same like you said eddie people didn't build at that time it was like you would put like you would everybody saved up nobody built until the very end and then at the very end everyone would save up their mats till the end and then they would build these big forts and at the end everyone would be in these big forts shooting at each other and if you had a rocket launcher you could take down or if you had a sniper you could get a hit and that's how end game would be nobody built during a fight you saved all your mats till the end and that was how fortnite was when i played it so it wasn't it like and then save the world i got into and then eventually i bought save the world and then i discovered like what fortnite really is and then i was addicted um <clears throat> but that was like that was how people play now like you build and cr you build as you play like you build as you move it's totally different um and it's a whole there's a whole brain thing going on you enjoyed fortnite when it was that yeah right <laughs> and then the kids went crazy with the building and now we can't keep up that's how i feel eddie <laughs> <laughs> but save the world is lit and i would love to stream it and link once said he would and i would love to get him in on it again but we'll see if i can do it did you order food louis <clears throat> nate banned link before because you were joking about it right it was link that that's crazy that nate banned link by accident how's it going pelican sorry if i missed your hello Yes, Unitrix. That's exactly what I do. I would stream Save the World and then everyone in chat would always want to play Battle Royale. So at the end of my Save the World streams, we do Battle Royale for a few rounds. And I will be honest, they would carry me because they all wanted to like, like, like Hunter. <laughs> you would carry me. Meg, if you play Save the World again, can I give you 144? Yeah, Hunter. Um, and he was the best and like hunter and like people like that got me all my stuff <laughs> i just said fortnite what's up it was dumb back then if i shoot at a person person they build a whole walmart around them and then kill me right totally it's full of crack 15 year olds that sift monster energy <laughs> yeah luke <laughs> it's true it's true it's all different now Okay, guys, so I want to leave now, and hopefully I'm right beside what I'm looking for. Or I'm going to get transported back to the other side of the map. But we'll see. I think I'm getting transported back to the other side of the map. I think that's what's happening. <clears throat> well, when Fortnite eventually comes to Stadia, we'll play together. Okay, Eddie, yeah, I guess. Let's do it. Maybe that's what Link is waiting for, too. I would prefer it to come to Stadia and then I stream it. Yeah, it took me right back to where I was. Damn it. But I paid for that trip. What was the point of that? That's dumb. All right, let's go. They can see sounds. And smell colors. The Oh, my God. <laughs> I want to see sound. Wouldn't it be cool to see music? Instead of just feeling it and hearing it, hearing it with your ear, feeling it with your ears. When it comes to Stadia, I will emote on everyone. <laughs> Not trying to be toxic. That's okay. Emoting in Fortnite isn't toxic. Emoting in Fortnite is social. Except when you kill somebody and then emote on top of them. But that's just gaming. We're all allowed to feel satisfied when we get a kill, no matter the circumstances. <clears throat> it was me feel lost yeah yeah me feel lost make that was a squad yeah exactly those were the days i'm gonna do like i want to stream a stream where we look at my old streams <laughs> that's what i should have done on my one year anniversary stream yeah. i didn't do a one year anniversary stream 
Guys, we're going to do a belated one year anniversary stream because my one year anniversary was Halloween, but I didn't have internet. Um, let's do an anniversary. What do you guys think? Chat people. Who's here? There's a bunch of people here. Chat. What do you guys think? Should we help this guy? Let's help. Wow, guys, I'm going to kill something. There, I helped that guy. Let's heal him. Dude, you need some heals, bro. Okay. Um. <clears throat> Ray, yeah, yeah, yeah. That skin I wanted to. Emoting over a dead body is socially toxic. There you go, Ashes. I like that. <laughs> Have you seen the clip of Ninja raging at a 5 year old girl? I've seen all. I've seen it all. Meg reacting. Yeah, so I want to go back and watch, like... Um, my first ever stream, um, which was a test, but I left it up. Oh, guys, I was going to change up my gear to make it more exciting when I killed things. Because right now when I kill, it's really boring. I just use the same stabby stabby. So I, I came up, I'm going to use wall of fire and alambrus or wall of frost and alambrus, which will give me like a firestorm. Um, I'll do it. I'll do it before I end the stream so you guys can see what I mean. When was my year first milestone? Halloween. My very first ever stream was Halloween. <laughs> October 31st. <laughs> I watched my first Dragon Ball Fighter back the other day. Wow, the difference. Right? It's so cool to go back and watch things you did in the past. Then at two years you react to the reaction. Yeah, Ashes, it'll just be a constant, like, loop. <laughs> um, but yeah, we could watch my first stream and watch, like... Um, I don't know. My, like, my first stream of, like, Red Dead. Or, like, my first stream of Division. You know what I mean? Like, stuff like that when I didn't know anything and I was just getting started. I think that would be cool. Alright, let's find this. And then I'm gonna change my gear around a little bit. And then I'll show you guys what I did with it. We'll go to Hundings, because, um, Dren has... Uh, dummies. Ah! They're doing a ritual here or something. What the hell is this? Oh, that guy's doing something. Okay, I'm just- excuse me, I'm not involved. I'm just gonna do some archaeology here in the corner. <laughs> there was a quote about Stabby Stabby. Yes, there's a couple- Ah! Oh god. I'm gonna help this guy with his little fight. <laughs> There you go, buddy. <laughs> now, excuse me, I'd like to do my archaeology. I like her implants. Ugh. I did like her implants a lot. <clears throat> you can't really choose your imp- like... You can choose your face implants in Cyberpunk, but you can't choose your body implants. And she had these really cool, like, gold things on her arm. Meg went ham when lightsabers got added to Fortnite. Yeah, they did a Star Wars, like, crossover. Fortnite has the best cross. You guys, you cannot, you cannot argue with Fortnite, honestly. The crossovers in that game are amazing. Um, and they did a Star Wars crossover. And I got the, you guys unlocked, like, Hunter and my friends, they unlocked the skin for me that I wanted and all the weapons. And, like, oh, my God, it was so fun. <clears throat> it's Fortnite Portal. 15 year olds are <laughs> jumping games. Fortnite events are amazingly done. Yeah. Like, I went to a marshmallow concert in Fortnite. Like, okay, Elder Scrolls, what have you got for me? You know? <laughs> but I agree. Um, Ashes. I do love Elder Scrolls, to be honest. But I do think I play it because it's on Stadia. My senses tell me that if I were, if I would play a different MMO. If I wasn't a dedicated Stadia gamer. Does that make sense? Like Guild Wars was my thing. I love Guild Wars. 
They even got the Predator. Yeah, they have so much. And the Batman one, Gotham City, that was cool. And they did a Borderlands crossover. So like one city that or one town that you landed on was all cell shaded, just like Borderlands. It was so cool. <clears throat> Okay, so guys, when I do PVE, I want to change up my gear. So let's go to Hundings um, and sell our stuff. And I'll adjust my gear a little bit so you guys can see what I'm talking about when I say that I want it to look cooler. Great game. Guild Wars Ashes, I feel like I knew that you liked that. That was my first MMO was the original Guild Wars. And then after that, I played WoW briefly. Didn't get addicted. Um, but I leveled, I played a lot. I, I maxed out a, a hunter, um, <clears throat> a dark elf. And, but I didn't get addicted. And then Guild Wars 2. Then I had no MMO for a while and then Elder Scrolls. Guild Wars on State would be amazing. Do you like it too, Luke? I agree. It would be awesome. That's a sick game. Oh my god. That was near and dear to my heart. But I do think Elder Scrolls potentially has more depth. So let's see. So I have 291,000. So let's sell all my stuff. So we're selling, oh god, I have to be careful not to sell anything I want to keep. Like the stairs Drennan sent me, oh my god, or the pumpkins, or the planks. Wow, I should have emptied my inventory before we started this. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> so I made 20,000. That's not very much. That's not enough. I need more. <laughs> We're going to have to do a lot of this. <laughs> um, okay, I have to deconstruct. I think I have a staff to deconstruct. Looking to forward to New World and Ashes of Creation. Yes. Um, I'm looking forward to both those games. Oh my god, I got addicted to New World so bad. I, did you see on their Twitter? I thought they were hinting that they were going to do another playable beta or whatever they called it, but I don't think they were. <laughs> I think it was just wishful thinking on my part. But New World, oh my god, I, I grinded so much I bought a house in town, Ashes. You have to be like, fact, like town level 15. Oh my god, I spent so many hours gathering and doing stupid stuff to hit that level so I could buy that house. So hopefully, if they come back, we keep all our stuff because I would love to show you guys the house I bought. And I even put one item or two items in it. I was trash and I got used to it. That's true. That is true because um, the first time that I played Elder Scrolls, I quit and I didn't play it for months. And I, and I didn't care for it. And then I came back and now I'm hopelessly addicted. So always be willing to give chances another try. Give games another try. Oh, we should wrap up soon. I love Guild Wars. Used to run home from high school. Same! Going on MSN Messenger with my friends. Same, Luke! Oh my god, same. MSN Messenger was how everybody talked. That's how I talked to my friends. And yeah, I'd come home from high school and I would just play Guild Wars. Like, I was, I was addicted to it. <clears throat> PUBG over Fortnite. Proximity chat is cool. I don't use proximity chat personally, but I like that games have it. And I like watching people who use it. That's cool. Did you get it, Hunter? The Predator skin? Yeah, I, I think Link told me that too, Ashes. There's going to be one more test. He pro You probably told him that. <laughs> or he told you. <laughs> we all get our information from each other. <laughs> Leave a like. Yeah, guys, thank you for all the likes today on the stream. Despite the weirdly boring stuff we've been doing. I find that you generally like games that have resource crafting and gathering. I do. I don't spend, like, I don't do crafting in this game. Or gathering anymore. But I like that the option's there. Um, okay, guys, I want to get a Lambrus. I think I'll do that next time, though. Because next time we'll do more fighting. Um, 
and you guys will see more. <laughs> Although I shouldn't say that. Maybe not. Maybe we'll just do this next time. But I do also do other things in this game that we can cover. <laughs> but let's go hang out by the water for a minute. Because Dren did an amazing job on the um, on this house in general, but especially down here. Look how nice this is. Oh my god. We didn't come down here when we were here earlier. There might be a PUBG too. Because the first PUBG is on Stadia, I would say that I assume if they made a PUBG too, it would also be on Stadia, but you never know. You just never know. I like to go in the water though. And I like to kind of just sit in the water <laughs> and enjoy the view. That looks nice. There. That's nice. Okay, guys, I am going to wrap it up. Can I have this be the background on my talking screen, I wonder? I think I can. That would be cool. Give me a second, guys, because I want to sit in the water. There we go. That was easy. Look at that. <laughs> there. Okay, guys. <laughs> Let's turn on our outro music, because I love it. <clears throat> there we go. So there we go, guys. I am going to wrap up this uh, scrying stream, which I think was fun. I think you guys liked it. I had fun. I wish we made more money, <laughs> but you can only do what you can do. But we'll do it again. Um... I think my writs I will not do, but I think we'll do stuff like this. And even like just questing by myself and stuff, I, you only have to half pay attention. Like this stuff I'm doing in the game is so easy, but I do want to get like my teammates and run dungeons, which is like more exciting. Scrying, am I crying stream? No, scrying, scrying. Um, it was my scrying stream, yeah. <laughs> Thank you all for watching me cry for three hours. Um, yeah, but I think it was great. So stay tuned guys. I don't know what I'm doing. So today is test day, so I may not stream later um, But if everything goes well, and then I just feel like it then I might stream later, but we'll see But definitely stay tuned guys leave a like subscribe if you're new turn on those notifications because I'm just gonna be streaming all the time now that I can <laughs> I can just do whatever I want <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, everybody take care, and uh, I will see you on the next one.